morning and welcome to WRMG TV 12 and also Television 97's coverage of Red Bay Tiger football. Welcome back to Fred Bostick Jr. Memorial Stadium for the 2022 football season. Folks, we've got new football players, we've got new cheerleaders, we've got new fans, a lot of new folks in the house of Red Bay. Uh, of course, always excited to start a football season. But folks, we've got new of all these other things, but we get the old guys still on the broadcast. Keith Kennedy down on the sideline for many, many years. Byron Helms on the camera for many, many years. And we got uh, Briley Mills in the press box with me up here tonight. We're excited about having Briley here tonight. And if you're out there joining us on a broadcast, we want you to share this link so your friends and family can enjoy the game wherever they're at tonight. We got wonderful sponsors, of course, that are going to make the game possible today. Our first downs tonight are brought to you by Community Spirit Bank. And, of course, we will not have the instant replay tonight. We had a little couple of issues, with, so we decided not to do that. And tonight's game brought to you by Robert Adderholt. And also Blue Boys, 24-hour gas pumps. Got the regular none, ethanol, the diesel, and more. Of course, that's across the bottom on Highway 24, owned and operated by Mr. Joel and Jody, uh, Mr. Joel Page and Jody Nethery. So we're excited about uh, them being on the broadcast along with a brand new sponsor tonight, Tupelo Eye Clinic, Dr. Ashley Horn Pickering, and also Beverly Winchester Green. She's the brand new owner at Bay Tree Gifts as a big sponsor of the game tonight. We're going to take it down sideline as the Red Bay Tiger cheerleaders are performing down below. And Keith Kennedy back for another year. You notice I called you the old <laughs> man now. You've been doing it a long time. We have. We sure have. Oh, you said we, did Yeah, you? we've been oh. doing it a long time. Keith, what do you know about this Red Bay Tiger squad? We do not have a lot of numbers. We've uh, we've lost some players for different reasons. And, uh, yeah, we've uh, uh, we just got three seniors. And uh, so our juniors, which uh, I think we got about 12 or so of those guys, going to have to step up and uh, uh, help, help lead. And uh, we got uh, don't have many many sophomores and a few freshmen and we've got some really good players we just don't have much depth so uh key to this year is going to be injuries we can stay away from those things and uh, uh but we got some some really good players so uh it'll be exciting to watch them play and uh i've uh i've watched them practice a few times and uh they're they've been working real hard uh, been working real hard in the weight room and uh they've been uh coming up here at seven o'clock in the morning and working out for for a while until school started so they've uh they've been getting ready so they're tired of hitting on each other they're ready to hit on somebody else tonight no so. doubt about it hey keith we got a brand new addition of the coaching staff uh me and you watch that young man play a oh lot. yeah the stump man yeah mr joseph boyd i that was in that's something else uh he he is going to be such an asset to uh red bay not just our <coughs> football team but all of our all of our sports basketball baseball track uh, softball he he's he has a lot of knowledge in conditioning and, and weightlifting and uh he, he's he's uh, got some real good programs and that's really going to be a asset to uh red bay for us to have uh, him decide to come over here more coach and teach school so that's a that's a great plus for us keith how big a deal is it to uh hamilton to have so many players on the sideline you know they they're going to probably dress out at least 40 tonight at, as opposed to our uh uh they're going to have 38 we're going to dress out maybe what low 20s maybe yeah. 22 and maybe not all those are varsity yeah there's uh, uh i think 22 or so 23 but i jackie's guys are again joseph boyd conditioning program he I'm telling you, they've they've uh, they've they've run a lot of a lot of miles and a lot of steps and, and lifted uh, quite a few weights, and they're in good shape. And so uh, it'll be a it'll be pretty hot tonight. So uh, hopefully we can uh, can withstand uh, uh, a team that's got more depth than we got. But uh, hopefully hopefully our guys will hang in there and and play tonight. Just get us just stay away from injuries. Keith, we also got a brand new principal. He's making his way out on the field now, Mr. Nanny. He's, yeah, yeah, he's, Mr. He's, Nanny. He's excited about being in Red Bay, Alabama, and of course he's close by. He's one of those Etowamba Countyans, and we're excited about him being here. Red Bay Tiger Marching Band will be performing at a halftime for us. Keith, after tonight, I don't know how tonight's going to turn out. Hoping for a big Tiger victory, but we got a week off uh, to kind of regroup after this. You see who's behind you there? 
don't talk to him now, but I want you to say yeah. something to him. The, yeah. guy, the world famous Strick man yeah. is yeah. back in town, so we're glad to have Strick with yeah. us here tonight. Today's game also brought to you by Spark CPA, six locations to serve you, along with the Red Bay Eye, Yucca, Muscle Shoals, Florence, Boonville, and Curry. Also, Alpha Insurance, located right here in Red Bay. Compliments of Dr. Ralph Nix, Debbie, Karen, Candy, B. Wish the Tigers good luck tonight. Go Tigers. Kim Lindsay, it's so cute for you. A big Tiger sponsor tonight. Also, Pro Concert, Mr. Terry Hayes down in Tupelo by Bliss Aesthetics, LLC. That's uh, new to Red Bay. Owner is Beverly Winchester Green, she's a licensed esthetician located at 408 First Street Southwest in Red Bay, specializing in sugar hair removal, individual skin care, facials, and much, much more. You can go to her website, give her a call. I know she'd love to hear from you to make an appointment, 256-460-9547. You'll leave feeling her office like the most rejuvenated self. For bookings, once again, see uh, the world famous, uh, once again, that is Beverly Winchester Green. Also on the broadcast tonight is Swamp John's Restaurant and Catering, home of the Jack Ivy Chicken on a Stick on Fridays. I did get two today, by the way. I always get two every Friday. Triple H Electronics on our broadcast here tonight. H.W. Watson Ladies Logging Company on our broadcast. Banner Tire Store. Also 5-H Farms with Donovan Han and all of the staff uh, at 5-H Farms. Also CJ's Grocery on a broadcast. We've got a moment of silence and then we're going to have a prayer and hopefully a national anthem. Let's listen in. National Anthem played by the Red Bay Tiger Marching Band. We're looking forward to hearing them tonight. They'll be performing at halftime. And I know uh, they're excited about got, their first yeah, performance here tonight. Out there on their broadcast, once again, this is WRMG TV 12 and also Television 97. Answer that for me. Honored, honored to have you on the broadcast here today on WRMG TV 12 and also Television 97. Once again, honored to have you on the broadcast here today on WRMG TV 12 and TV 97. I hadn't, I hadn't touched anything, so. Once again, this is WRMG TV 12 and also Television 97, the Ivy Broadcasting Company. Today's game brought to you by CJ's Grocery Bait and Tackle, serving quality food at affordable prices. Don't forget daily lunch specials Monday uh, through uh, Monday to Thursday, and also on Fridays, you got that farm raised catfish plate with slaw and fries until 6 o'clock. Once again, that's CJ's 256 332 13. 24. Once again, also on a broadcast here today from WRMG is Williams Pest Control and Insulation. Tyler Wooten got that blown in insulation in the attic, hanging insulation to the walls. Call him at 662 uh, 454 3383. Also, Ellis Wooten at Brick Driven Realty on our broadcast. Also, Fancher's Taxidermy, your one stop does it all. And that's Jerry Paul with 27 years experience in uh, taxidermy, also 12 years in the deer processing. 256-460-0404. Also to broadcast today is Mr. Gary Armstrong. It does all your doze, your backhoe work by Thompson Gas Company, the most trusted name in propane, locally operating. 
356-2194. Right now is the time to uh, get your uh, pre-bookings in right now. Save money. You can book it in, I think, at like 239 right now. Who knows, between now and the end of winter, who knows how high it can go, but you'll have your price booked in. So you need to call Thompson Gas, 356-2194. Also, a big uh, brand new sponsor tonight is Bell Haven Heights Gifts. Now open inside the historic hotel in Red Bay, 107 4th Street. Your owner there is Sherry Ferris. Current hours are Tuesday through Friday, 10 to 4, Saturday, 9 to 1. So you've got a baby and bridal registry available. Also, bereavement gifts available. Unique gifts and great finds. And also, delivery available inside the city limits. Call 356 2200. Once again, the name of the business, Bell Haven Heights located inside Hotel Red Bay. Brandon Nunley Construction Company also on a broadcast here today for all your plumbing, wiring, and construction needs. Call Brandon Nunley, 256-412-6500. Also, Barry Cook, uh, CLC Spray Foam Insulation, proud to be sponsoring the Tigers tonight. 256-483-0140. Ronald Thorne, your State Farm agent by the Neighbors Clinic. Dr. Jim Neighbors and his great staff 356-9537 by Red Bay Pharmacy, Bill and Donna Weatherford. And, of course, they got a location right here in Red Bay and also Belmont Pharmacy. The Cardinal Drive-In on the Colden Road. Thank you, Miss Denise. Allen and Nash Harden and Harden Heating and Cooling and the boss, Miss Anita. Thank you all. 356-8913 by Red Bay Rentals. Climate control units available as well from the world-famous Johnny Weatherford. He's got some 10 by 20 units right now available. Uh, 256 668 0039 784 7th Avenue in Red Bay. Shannon Oliver, your Franklin County Sheriff, by Predator Pest Control, the Insect Predator, by Red Bay Nutrition Smoothie and Juice Bar. The shakes are 24 to 25, 27 grams of protein, only uh, 200 to 250 calories, and very little sugar, only 5 to 13 grams of sugar, loaded in vitamins and minerals. Folks, you can't beat. Red Bay Nutrition. They support your Red Bay Tigers and they support this broadcast as well. Also Sunshine Homes on our broadcast. Builders of quality homes since 1971. By your hometown Piggly Wiggly in Belmont, Red Bay and Iuka. And also Ace Hardware. The City of Red Bay, the Mayor and the Council. By Explore Liquidation. Good luck to the Tigers from the management and staff at Explore Liquidations. Keith Kennedy's down on the sideline. Keith, we're getting closer and closer. We got uh, a lot of brand new sponsors here tonight, and a lot of sponsors have been with us forever. Wanted to try to mention some of those sponsors as we are getting ready for a broadcast tonight. Keith, uh, some of these folks have been with us uh, a long, long time, haven't they? They sure have, and uh, they've been they've been able to us to be able to give these broadcasts for a lot of years, and uh, we. We sure treasure them. No doubt about it. Today's game also brought to you by the Red Bay Hospital, taking care of your friends and neighbors close to home. By Franklin County Probate Judge Barry Moore. By Redmont Heating and Cooling with Patrick Brooks, 662-279-6569. By Redmont Pharmacy, J.C. Weeks. The Red Bay Yacht Club, located at Red Bay Acres RV Resort. They're open Monday through Friday, 7 to 2, and on uh, Thursday through Saturday, 4 to 8. So once again, uh, their hours are Monday through Friday, 7 to 2. On Thursdays, they're also open 4 to 8, uh, Thursday through Saturday. So we got you covered 7 to 2, Monday through Friday, but would also open on Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, 4 to 8. And they got some wonderful food at Red Bay Yacht Club. Also, Red Bay Acres RV Resort. Uh, check out that general store there in Red Bay, 333-4436. Keith's working his way back down this way. We'll have the captains uh, working their way out. State Center to Larry Stutz on our broadcast. Eddie's Collision on our broadcast. Located at Highway 24 from Red Bay. For all your body and glass repair, for towing and much more, it's Hicks Towing. That number 332-9090. It's Eddie's Collision. By the Smith Animal Clinic on our broadcast. Lindsay Turbeful Smith. That number 356-2800. Hours of Monday through Friday, 8 to 5, closed from 12 to 1 for lunch, and they're also closed on the weekend. Smith Animal Clinic is a mixed animal vet clinic, and they do a wonderful job. Also, Carl Lewis Sausage Stadium Pros, Keith Kennedy, Alton Marksdale by the Medical Clinic of Red Ladies Bay, Dr. Raynard Fabianchi. By Community Spirit, Spirit Bank, your hometown bank with hometown solutions since 1908. Also, Fastway Car Wash, Miss Ann Vincent out on Highway 19. 
Keith Kennedy, the captains are getting ready to make their way out. Keith will be making his way out on the field here in just a minute. We'll listen to the coin toss. Today's game brought to you by your Edward Jones agent, Mr. Mike Jones. Mike, you've been serving Franklin Tishman on Etowamba County now for over 20 years. 332-79-24. Once again, this is Red Bay Tiger football on WRMG TV 12 and TV 97. We've got the world famous Briley Mills. Briley, uh, I'm excited about it. Of course, you, you helped us a little bit earlier, and uh, we don't know what all Briley is going to be doing, but I can tell you he's going to be helping us a lot during basketball, baseball, softball, and football. We're going to add that sideline camera maybe next game. What do you think about that? That sounds like, sounds like a great idea. Well, you know, we had a little issue tonight that kind of messed us up on that, so we decided to back off from that. But we got a new uh, wireless system where, when I say wireless, Wiley, uh, Riley hadn't got about, matter of fact, we could probably send him out to midfield for the coin toss as far as that goes. So we, it'll be in high definition as well. So, uh, Riley, I want you to say hello to the folks out there. Hello, everybody. Uh, hope we have a great season and go Tigers. No doubt about it. Riley Mills joining us here on WRMG. Keith, uh, what about uh, the Red Bay Tigers? Can you hear me? I got you. We got uh, Brady Hard number 11. Uh, Caden Keaton, number two, and uh, John Schatz, number 66, the captains tonight. Whole uh, crew of uh, folks over from Hamilton. Yeah, they got, they, they got a lot of folks over there. Yeah. Kate, uh, of course, mentioned uh, Caden Keaton, number two. He's a senior. Number 11, Brady Harden, he's a senior. And also number 66, uh, John Schatz. You mentioned earlier we only got three seniors, and yeah, this is them. That's, them. that's that's the crop. Good ones, though. Good no, ones, no doubt about it. So Keith and the captains are on the way out to midfield. We got a familiar face, uh, Mr. Henry, the head man on the field tonight, and uh, them. we'll we'll listen in. Number seven, Thomas Angel. Number ten, Hatcher. and we do not have number eleven on the roster. For your Red Bay Tigers, number two, the senior Caden Keaton. How's everybody? Good for you. Right. Everybody ready for football? Good luck, sir. Okay. John All right, guys, Stratton, let's have good senior. sportsmanship, okay? Starts right now and goes through the entire ball game. Win, lose, or draw, we're going to have good sportsmanship, okay? Sir. Any sir. questions for anybody? Yes, All right. Good luck. You're the visitor. I'll let you call it. I've got a heads and i got tails. What are you going to call? Heads. He's going to call heads. If I drop it, I'll flip it again. It's heads. You've won a toss. The fire defend scoreboard. Well, all you can do is oh, the fire. All right. Yes, White won the toss. Hamilton won the toss, and uh, they're the fur, and so they're going to kick off to the Tigers. Hamilton won the toss. So we'll get a chance to see what the Tigers do on the offensive end. Uh, Keith, we bring uh, a little experience on the offensive side at quarterback. Oh, here. yes. So, um, We'll see what the Tigers do. Red Bay's going to be receiving. Red Bay's going to be going left to right. And, of course, that'll be uh, heading back toward the uh, field house and uh, locker room there. So, uh, got a wonderful spirit line from both teams. So, we're about ready to get this underway. Brought to you by David Hester, your District 4 conditioner. By Triple D's Bucket Service, Barney Brandon and Dustin Dick. By the Deaton Funeral Home of Red Bay and Belmont. By MK Infusion Pharmacy, Missy Montgomery. She's over in Muscle Shoals. 256-320-7611 by Tiffin Motorhomes. Tiffin Supply, Tiffin Appliance Company. And ladies and gentlemen, here come the Red Bay Tigers. The Red Bay Tiger football is a production of the Ivy Broadcasting Company. Honored to have you here tonight on your hometown station. Hope you enjoyed the stream on Facebook tonight. We'll replay it on YouTube. We'll replay it on television. We'll give you many opportunities uh, to enjoy the game. Today's game, I told you, brought to you by Tristead Insurance. Uh, of course, Miss Brenda Purser right here in Red Bay, 356-4804. By Bay Health and Wellness. Go Tigers from Kayla Humphries and her staff, 376-2036. And also a big shout out to Dr. Rick Wooten at Wooten Chiropractic. 301 Jackson Avenue in Russellville, Alabama by Day, Bay Diesel and Air Conditioning. Silver Dollar Bargains. Of course, Bay Diesel and Air Conditioning. That's Chris and Valerie Marr. Silver Dollar Bargains down in Golden, Hamilton and Chippewa by Miller's Affordable Furniture. Jason Miller, your County Commissioner District 2. Greg Hamilton, your Superintendent of Education. By Casey Johnston, your School Board Member. 
by Funderflow Commercial and Residential Pressure Washing. That's Micah Funderburg. Dr. Brad Gentleman, your family doctor at Shows Primary Care, 256 383 4473. Of course, that's Miss Sierra Hubbard Gentleman. So if you want to kind of tie in, if you didn't know who Dr. Brad is, he married Sierra here from Red Bay. They're doing a wonderful job at the uh, family medical uh, place that shows primary care. Also, Cash and Thermoplastics on a broadcast, Franklin Electric, CBNS Bank, Sunshine Mills Big Star, and also Community Spirit Bank. And don't forget Congressman Robert Anderholt and the kickoff to the Tigers is pretty deep, and that ball is going to be picked up at about the one-yard line. Back to the 10. Side steps up to about the 17-yard line. And Keith, he had a pretty good ways to get out of there, and he probably did good to get to the 17. Yeah, they uh, they didn't uh, – they wasn't deep enough, and he kicked it over his head, and uh, he had to go back to the one-yard line and pick it up. And so he's got it back out to the 17. That was uh, Mr. Lamphere. It's going to be first and 10 from the 17. I haven't looked to see if you're going to have trouble with any names tonight. Do you know we can we can go to initials if we have to. Oh, you've done that before, right? That's right. Hey, do me a favor if you're watching the game right now, please share it. We want to get a lot of folks out there watching. Your quarterback is Gage Edgman. Tigers in the old uh, wing tee here. He'll check off of the line. Got a receiver split to the right. He's going to bring that ball to the right. 15 up to the 20. Cut it back to the 25, 30, 35. Got a flag at the 40. Yeah, up we're going to the get us a yard line. get us for a clip. On that cutback at about the 32-yard line is where the flag come in. But a good run, I guess maybe that clip might have helped out a little yeah, bit. Yeah, it's 25. 25-yard run, and a clip's up about the 31. So they're going to move it back to about the 21 and uh, so or 22. So we picked up five yards. I was about to say one of them Community Spirit Bank first downs, but I'm going to have to wait on it a little bit, Brad. I want to say a uh, special thanks to Brad and all the folks from Community Spirit Bank for helping fund our uh, new wiring and uh, to get our uh, computer, I mean, everything situated where we got uh, some good TV, not only in the concession stand, but up in the uh, Tiger Den as well. Thank you, Brad, and also Community Spirit Bank. First down and about six to go for the first down. This time it's coming back to the right side again, over the 25 to the 27. Keep he's down, here. he's down. They, uh, he fumbled the ball, but they caught him down. So he's going to be close to a first down. It's going to maybe third and one or second and one. No, they're going to call it first down. And that will be another uh, or the first Community Spirit Bank first down. Don't forget contact pavements are available via Apple and Android Pay. So the Tigers, well, they ain't never moved the uh, – Hurry up, hurry up. They ain't moved the change. The initial call is the first down. How the referees are conversing. I don't think it's going to be a first down, do you, Keith? Well, I didn't think it was, but they, they made motions for it. So I think it's. <laughs> they're going to measure it to, yeah. uh, to double check. So that may not be a Community Spirit Bank first down just yet. So we'll have to do it. Keith, we got, uh, of course, Congressman Robert Adderholt making the game possible. And you know the new station across the bottom, Blue Boys, 24-hour oh, gas yeah. pumps. Of course, the world-famous Joel Page, Jody yes, Nedry taking care. Yes, sir. Byron, Joel's one of my buddies. Byron's got us a great shot, and he's going to show us that it is not going to be a first down. It's going to be close. Yeah, what, half a yard or something? Yeah, six inches. Six, second, and half a yard. They got you know you know what Coach Mills run? He'd be a quarterback, quarterback sneak. sneak. Yes, sir. Riley might be a quarterback sneak. Uh -huh. You know, they got those homemade biscuits, the five-ounce ribeye with a Texas toast, some of those head uh, hand-breaded uh, chicken fingers, six-ounce hamburgers on a Hawaiian bun, fresh cookies, all made daily fresh pies. Make sure you check them out out at Blue Boys in the bottom. Three two five six three three zero zero one two three, and there's a handoff. There's a first down. First down for the Red Bay Tigers. Honored to have you on the broadcast here today, Brady Harden, one of the seniors. Yeah, we're at the 31-yard line here, Jack. First and ten. 
So that'll be a Community Spirit first down. Don't forget their member FDIC since 1908. Yeah. A couple of locations right here in Red Bay, over in Viner, Russellville, Alabama. Got uh, down in Belmont and also down in Etiwamba County at Fulton, Mississippi. Let me know if you're watching the game and how good it looks and uh, maybe share this link for us. We're going to a little trap back this way, oh, 35. Oh, feet up. Oh, he just barely clipped him there. Up to about the, uh, close to the 39-yard yeah, line. Yeah, picked up about eight yards there. So the Tigers will pick up about eight on that one, second down and two to go. Jack yeah. Ivey and, of course, Riley Mills up here in the box. Uh, got our next door great cameraman, Mr. Byron Helms and Keith Kennedy. Down on the side. Now, you've drove a lot of miles to get back here. Today. Yeah, they, I have, but they've just sort of been running uh, off tackle and uh, on our right side, number 60, and, and uh, been getting good blocks over here for us. Gage Edgewin, the quarterback, going to go to the right, left yeah. side with Harden. There's got Jones. another flag. Ooh. He got the first down with another flag. Guy way back there in the back yeah. through that flag. Boy. So do me a favor, share, share this link, folks. So I want to say hello to Kenny Nichols out there, Carol Warner, Susan Ledbetter, Joel Rooker, Mac Nellon Williams, Gavin Lynch, Amanda Mills, Coach Donnie Roberts, Johnny Stockton, Rex Patterson, Brenda Elliott, Laura Horn, Horn, Joan Cleveland, Sylvia Lyles. Uh, coming in loud and clear, John Matson, he's out in San Francisco. Chris Brazel out there. David Leatherwood said we're sounding great. Thank you, David. Lane Osborne. Thank you, Lane. Ryan Barksdale. Uh, John Matson wanting us to start the season right tonight. Justin Scott with us. Randy Ivey out there with us as well. Uh, Kelly Moore said it's looking great. I'm telling you, that's such a that's such a chicken call there, a chop block. Uh, that's that's so bad. Keep looking at we got about third down and close to 20 this time. We're going to hand it off down. 30 up to the 33, maybe the 35. They're going to be close. They're going to mark him a little bit shy of that. That was second down. Now it'll be third down. Keith, we're uh, we're successful running the ball against this Hamilton Ball Club. Yeah, we've been getting good blocking. It's uh, third and six. Uh, Keith, when we but get I'm telling you. That chop block, that, that's such a call. That, it, that the call is where you got you got a defender engaged up high, and then somebody uh, gets in his feet. And I'm people people's getting knocked down and knocked around. And that's such a that's a, that's a terrible call. They shouldn't even have that. Tigers make an adjustment at the line, and we got third down and about six to go for the first down. We're going to run it back to There's the left side. Number 17 running the football is Cody Carnes. He's, he's close. Junior. Keith, he's going to be about a yard short. We're going to be looking at fourth down and a yard. Yeah. Coach Heath Childers wouldn't uh, gamble. You bet. Fourth down, Tigers. We've yeah. ran the ball successful. Number 22, Holden Inman checking in. I like that young man, don't you? Oh, yeah. He's 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 an outstanding young man. Of course, they like him up at Red Bay Nutrition as well. Yeah. All right. We got... Fourth, fourth and one. This Big gamble right here for the Tigers. Uh, we'll see if we can get it. Fourth down in a yard. Quick handoff. Number it. 11. Well, he had it, and then they pushed him back, and then they're they, pretty sure he was down. They said he was down, yeah. but they're going to mark him at the 40. Uh, Let's hope we can play this one again because if not, they're going to get the football. They're talking it over, Keith, across the way. I think we motion. We dropped the ball over there. That's yeah. That, that we had a first down. He dropped it. Yeah, so. we're at uh, we're at the 39. Yeah. We'll see what the uh, call is here. Thank you, Bakery Gifts, Beverly, Winchester Green, the brand new owner, Bakery Gifts, got the Babel Bridal Registry and many many gifts items, and and of course she's going to be uh, bringing in a lot of new merchandise. So get ready for. The change is out at Baytree. She's excited about being the brand new owner. Spark CPA, six locations to serve you along with Alpha Insurance. We have no score in Red Bay. You got the scoreboard at the bottom there. Dr. Ralph Nix and his great staff. Thank you, Miss Debbie, Karen, Candy, and B. Uh, go Tigers. Also, Kim Lindsay, it's so cute for you on our broadcast. So they are going to step off five. 
from about the 40-yard line. That'll move it back to the 35. So we're going to be looking at fourth down and six, Keith. Yeah, that's I get, the way that turned out. I guess that's the best of the best. Cause we dropped the ball. We got a first down, but dropped the ball. So now we're going to punt it away. Who's that punting back? Number there? sixty. Number sixty. Reed Hamilton. Reed Hamilton. The sophomore will be punting. They're back at about their own thirty-yard line. They be in the Hamilton. Aggies. There's the punt. High, not very deep, but high. And it takes a bounce. And there's a long flag thrown at about uh, their 46-yard line. We we downed it at the 39-yard line, but there's a flag up at the 46. Keith, did you see anything? No. On that? We're not going to be able to play this ball game for referees calling penalty. It's unbelievable. Mr. Henry's coming in to see what these other guys are doing. He may tell them, say, guys, lay off. We've got a block in the back against Hamlin. That's going to be in our favor. So yeah. the line of scrimmage being the 39, that's going to back it up. And, uh, 15. You know, we get a week off next week. No, I didn't. We do get a week off next week. Oh. Then we're going to bring out the sideline camera. You're going to be down there. So they're going to step it off from the 46. That's where the flag uh, was thrown. So they're supposed to step it off from where the ball was down. That's what they were supposed to do. Are they changing I don't, their mind? I don't think they know what they're doing. This is. Now he is going to step it off That's, from the it's 39. Supposed be, it's supposed to be from where the ball was dead. Not worry through the flag. Yeah, right? not worry through the flag. Oh, yeah. That moves it back to the 29-yard line. It'll be first down in 10. Thank you, Pro Concert. Mr. Terry Hayes does all your church sound systems, media systems, projector screens, all types of camera systems. And they do work on it, by the way. Hamilton hands it off. They're going to bring it left side to the 30, 35, 40. We got a flag as he's knocked out of bounds by the Red Bay Tigers. Look like Brady Bolton, one of the guys up there to knock him out. Jack West in the vicinity there, and Keith. Uh, they're pretty good, good run, but they're going to have to back that one up. Yeah. The chain gang's already oh, moved. Yeah. Yeah. Whole. Chain guys have already moved, and uh, but they're going to have to come back. Their quarterback is Mason Holiday. He wears number two. Running back, one of the running backs is Dawson Taylor. He wears number four. Another running back, Kevin McBride, number 24. Elijah Dollar will be one of the receivers. The tight end, of course, is Devin Vasquez. Another receiver is Jaden Hatcher. It's going to be first and eight, we'll call it. Got a couple of big guys uh, being moody and people and Hudson up on that line along with McCuller. They're in white. The Red Bay Tigers are in blue with the white helmets. It'll be first down and eight yards to go about their own 31-yard line. Quarterback's handing it off to the right side. Number seven, that's yeah. Thomas Angel, another yeah. running back yeah, in the game. Yeah, that's tackle over there by 56. That's Mr. West, Mr. West and, uh, and uh, 22 over there, Mr. Inman. We need a good game out of them West boys. Yeah, tonight, that's don't. Second down and call it second and seven. They got the ball at about their own 32-yard line. Thanks to Bliss Aesthetics, LLC, Beverly Green. And, of course, uh, she's licensed, uh, located at 408 First Avenue, specializing in sugar hair removal, individualized skin care, facials, and much, much more. We'll tell you more about that as the night goes on. Hand off up the middle. He's going to be short of the first down. They'll have third down and uh, short at about the 38-yard line. They be in Hamilton. Let me know what it looks like on the broadcast, folks. We need to hear from you. It's going to be third and one. He picked up five yards, just sort of running right at us there. We got live coverage uh, down in Iuka tonight as they get a first down. Tishomingo County getting ready to take on Alcorn Central down there. As, as number 56 in on the bottom of tackle there, number 66, Mr. Shots there. 11, Mr. Brady Harden.
First down and 10, Hamilton. They'll bring it up to the line of scrimmage, 41 yard line. They'll bring a receiver, number three. That's uh, Keandre Ford split out to the left. He was moving, so yeah, they, they Jack they Ivey even caught that one. Yeah, they got him. Of course, he was right there in front of the uh, side judge there. So that'll back him up five. It'll be first down and 15 at about the 36-yard line. Keith, I know you've been looking forward to football season uh, for a little while. Yeah. Uh, a lot of anticipation, uh, not yeah. only on the high school level, but the college level as well. And yeah. It's going to be first and 15. These folks around this part of the country love their football, don't they? They sure do. They sure do. That's, that's, a, that's a thing that brings a lot of people together. No doubt about it. First down and 15, about their own 36-yard uh, line. Hamilton with the football. Quarterback is under center. He'll hand it off to the first man through the Tigers, stack him up, but push him a little bit forward up to about the 40-yard line before he's pushed back. Keith, I know he's got every Tiger that was in on that stop. There yeah, was a bunch of them. 64 there, and uh, number 11, Brady Harden was in on that. So. 64, Jack West. Yeah. And uh, eight, eight. it's going to be second and 10. You got a timeout now on the field. We're talking about 5.49 to go in the first quarter. There's no score in the ball game. Tonight's broadcast is brought to you by Casey Lott. He's the owner of the largest personal injury firm in Northeast Mississippi. You can call him at 662-554-4000. Also, Swamp John's Restaurant and Catering. Don't forget Thursday, fish day. Friday, of course, chicken on a stick. They're open when uh, Thursday. Let me make sure they... Uh, they're open now Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, 6 in the morning till 7. On Thursday, 6 to 8, and Friday and Saturday, they got some new hours, and we're excited about bringing that back from Swamp John's. Full menu plus deli buffet, pizza on Saturday, located at Highway 24, 247. Also, Triple H Electronics, David Humphreys and the crew at Triple H. Go Tigers from Abby, Macy, and Leeton Humphreys. H.W. Watson Logging Company, Kevin and Harold, Highway 9 in Viner. They're the buyer of your timber and timberland. 256-810-8141. By the Banner Tire Store, Jason Parker down on the Fairview Banner Road. By CJ's Grocery Bait and Tackle, open seven days a week over in Bell Green, Alabama. Got the 24-hour pump. Stop by for ethanol-free gas as well. 187 and 24, 256-332-1324. It's CJ's Grocery. And also 5H Farms, a little toss. Tiger's going to run him down, get a hold of him. Number oh, 17, Cody Carnes oh, brings him down. Yeah, that's, that's a really good play. Really good play by a really good player. And uh, he played that just, you know, coaches draw these defensive plays up on the uh, chalkboard, and uh, you couldn't play it any better than that right there. So good play. Way to go. No doubt about it. Good job. You know, they the first time uh, – they ran that play, they picked up about 15, 20 yards, you know, but they had a clip on it or a hole, but uh, we got them. It's third down and 14. They need to get to our 49-yard line. They've got third down and about 13 to go for the first down. Quarterback under center, rolls out to the right, looking downfield. We're chasing him now. He dumps it off, incomplete up at the 50-yard line. So Mason Holloway's pass is incomplete, and it'll be fourth down for Hamilton. Yeah, as a good defensive uh, series, we we uh, uh, contained that quarterback pretty good. He got outside a little bit, but uh, he was throwing it on the run and uh, and just didn't hit his receiver. And we had him covered pretty good. So as a as a good defensive series. Appreciate 5H Farms, Donovan Haley and the family there. Williams Pest Control Insulation. Uh, of course, you got the world famous. Uh, Tyler Wooten there, 662-454-3383. Fourth down, they'll punt from about the, well, he kicked it from about his own 29. We receive it 32, 35, 40, up to a 45-yard line. Great return by the Red Bay Tigers. Yeah, number 17. Hey, we're up to about the 47. We've got good field position. So Carnes making it happen on both sides yeah. of the ball. Yeah, you see he caught that ball in there, Jack. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You like that? Yeah, I like that. Yes, sir. Do me a favor if you've not shared this. Uh, there's Ian and Bree McCoy checking in. Joe Tester, Olave Glover and Oscar out there. Amanda yeah. Lee, Lee Mills. Number 10's in there, Mr. 
Braden, Braden Town. Hope you're enjoying the broadcast. Thank you, Amanda. That's a great compliment there. I don't know where I should tell everybody, but uh, 47 and the quarterback back to pass. He's looking a little swing pass. Uh, out of bounds, number five is Kyler Watson. Joe Tester, Farron Criddle out there. Tony Folks with us out there. Margaret Biffle rooting for Eli Ferris, number nine. Uh, I am, uh, let's say, I guess his grandmother watching from Pontotoc. His papa's there at the game. I couldn't go, but glad my husband did. And we're glad that you're watching, uh, Miss Margaret. And we appreciate Miss Sherry and Jody and the entire family. Second down and about nine to go for the first down. That last play only got about a yard. Hand off, good running room. Down to the 43 yard line, the Red Bay Tigers. Uh, it's good, good running, hard running there by Brady Hart, number 11. He's gonna be awful close to the first down. Yeah, he's... Uh, That'll be uh, hopefully another community spirit Frank first a, down, but they go a little mark short. It. They're gonna mark it just a touch short. I didn't think we got a good spot then. Hey, Ellis Wooten with Brick Driven Realty, your North Alabama real estate specialist on a broadcast. Contact him at 256-460-0598. For all your real estate needs, Ellis Wooten is the man to see. Also, big shout out to Gary Armstrong. It does all your doze, your backhoe work. And also Jerry, Paul, Charlene, Grant, and all the folks at Thatcher's Taxidermy. We got a move, flag. Move, move. So instead of third and less than one, now we're gonna have third and uh, over five to go for the first down. That happened to us last time, and uh, yeah. instead of being short, uh, Jerry Paul's got 27 years taxidermy. He's got 12 in deer processing, and you can call him it. Hey, I saw him one day, and he had a trailer load of deer. Oh, really? He's headed to headed to Miami, Florida with them. Oh, he takes them everywhere. He, yeah. He, when you're good, you're good. Uh, well, I mean, these these are whole deer. You oh. know, it wasn't just a head. It was a whole deer. 256-460-0404. Third down and seven to go for the first down. I'm not even sure they stepped off five. Toss back to number one. He's got a first down. Down the sideline, inside the 40, down to the oh. 36. Mr. Yeah. Keaton Lampfear. Yeah, he's, he got outside and... Little, that fellow's got a little shake and bake about him and made some moves and they missed it. He picked up uh, about 12 yards. Good job, Keaton. Madison Hester out there watching. Tony Folks says him and Autumn's out there watching. That's Tony and Amanda's little girl. Honored to have you on the broadcast. Let me know where you're watching tonight. I need every single person that's watching now. I'm talking about every single person that's watching to share this. You got to take time. Bradley Brooks, you'll do it, won't you? There's a Kendrick and Michaela Bennett out there watching. Make sure you all share it. If you all will share it, you all help us get the word out to more and more folks. We had to call time out. We was clock was play clocks about to run. See, it's got one second on there, and we, we were just getting up the line. So call time out, save a delay a game penalty there. Keith, a big grab, uh, hand out to Thompson Gas Company, the most trusted name in propane. 356-2194, you need to book that gas and get it locked in. You can lock in a price and it'll be good through the winter. And you know it's gonna go up. Hey Jack, on, when that, that play that uh, Lamphere got outside there on third down, uh, so our wide outs out there got engaged with those guys, defensive backs and tied them up to get him, uh, get him that first down. So it takes them all. No doubt about it. Today's game also brought to you by Bellhaven Heights Gifts, now open inside historic Hotel Red Bay, 107 4th Street. Your owner is Sherry Ferris. Current hours right now, Tuesday through Friday, 10 to 4, Saturday, 9 to 1. Baby and bridal registry available, bereavement gifts available, and guess what? She delivers inside the city limits, 356 2200. Unique gifts and great finds are available at Bellhaven, and she's going to continue to add to her collection there at Bellhaven Heights. Brandon Nunley Construction Company on a broadcast. He's got one of them cheerleaders down there now. He said, I, I got to keep coming to these ball games. I got a cheerleader down there. All right, all right. I won't tell you he was eating. Whew, Lord, was he eating out at Swamp John's oh. today. All right, Tigers got first down and 10 after that Community Spirit Bank first down. We're going to toss it to the right side. He oh, makes a turn. Yeah. Another flag on the field. 25 to the 20. Oh, cuts it back right. down near the 15-yard line. We're going to get us holding probably. Two flags back at about our own 35-yard line. 
holding against the Red Bay Tigers. Holding. We are our own worst enemy so far, right? Shoot, we. Appreciate Barry Cook. Got your uh, spray foam insulation. Feel nice. more comfortable. Uh, have lower energy bills. And uh, he does a wonderful job. 256-483-0140. For a free estimate, call Barry Cook. Once again, he does all your spray foam insulation. 256-483-0140. And honored to have you on the broadcast today. Thanks to just Neighbors a, Clinic. We and just got a, we just Bay, got another penalty. Red Bay just got an unsportsmanlike uh, on coach. I didn't know he was talking to the referee. I thought he was talking to maybe one of the players. But uh, Coach Childers just got an unsportsmanlike. So we're going to have uh, a holding stepped off first. And then on top of that, another 15-yarder. You know, Ronald Thorne, your State Farm agent, proud to sponsor the game tonight. He writes insurance not only in Red Bay, but in Mississippi as well now. 356-4459. Whether it's home, auto, personal, whatever you need, see Ronald Thorne. Also, Red Bay Pharmacy, Bill and Donna Weatherford on a broadcast where you can get that BioLite. It's called an IV in a bottle. Well, I think a few folks may have shared it. We're picking up some new folks. Thank you, Jane Edwards and Jim Parker out there. <laughs> Uh, John Matson out in California. We used to say he's up in Maine. He's out in California. He's been wait waiting on Friday night to return. Barbara Kay out there with us. And uh, like I say, it's an honor to have you on the broadcast here tonight. I'll tell you about a, another sponsor of tonight's game here in just a second. Uh, Who I don't know. I don't know about this bunch, Jack. We've you know been what? for a long night. Woo. I don't know it. We're going to hand it off on first down and long up to the 35. We didn't really pick up anything. And we right. got another flag. I thought that I was thinking it was going to mark him back at the line of scrimmage. And uh, we just got another flag, Jack. What's this one? Personal foul. Personal foul, Red Bay. So I don't know what that situation on. So they're going to step off another one. Let's see, 15, 30, that's 40 yards in penalties this drive, right? All right, love you. You talking to me? No, oh. no. I, Keith's down there saying I love you, and I Greg, thought he's talking to me. He's Greg, to Greg called me. Oh, he's talking to Greg, so. Well, you still love us up here, don't you? That's it. That's it. You got to remember that microphone is sensitive. We was all thinking you was telling us you love us up here in the press box. But it was Craig. That's Craig. Second down. Folks, we got to get all the way down to their 24-yard line. We had our own about 20. We're going to toss it to the right from Lamphere. Lamphere up to the 24-yard line. Live coverage of Red Bay Tiger football. I'm Jack Ivey live. And uh, let's see here. What else was I going to tell you here in a minute? Keith, we got a. We got a, We still know scoring the ball this game. This may be the longest third down I've ever seen in. Minute 23 <laughs> to go. I want to say hello to Consider the Lilies, your home hometown florist and gift shop for all occasions. Don't forget uh, veteran and family owned at 112 4th Street across from the old water tower. And uh, Consider the Lilies provides local delivery and service to Deaton Funeral Home and the surrounding areas. Got fresh and artificial flowers once again. Consider the Lilies, Ian Bree McCoy. They're open, of course, at 356 8313. Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday, 9 to 5, 9 to 12 on Wednesdays. Thank you, Ian and Bree McCoy, uh, for making this game possible here tonight. Don't forget about the Cardinal Drive-In as we move to fourth down. Cardinal Drive-In, Miss Denise, check them out after the game tonight. Also, Allen and Ash Harden. Keith, remember, keep that. Uh, do you, what do you have to do to break a rib? Do you normally need to be working or doing something? We're going to punt it, and, and it takes a Hamilton bounce, and they're going to get it by their own 49-yard. Keith, 
do, wouldn't you think you need to be doing something or working if uh, to get a broke rib? Yes. Alan Harden's got, I heard, has got a broke rib. Oh my goodness! Hey, well, you hey, know, got to do something to get a broke. He, he's he's, he's get, getting on up there in age, and you know, they, he gets fragile, and sometimes them just bones a little thinner, and they just break sometimes. I I understand that. Uh, I don't I don't think it was from work. <laughs> it might it might be from a fall. You know, he's getting old now. Guess who I saw yesterday? The world famous David Tiffin. Oh my goodness. Kelly Moore. Okay. Wayne Sims okay. and Jim Levette. All right. With their better halves and family members. Huh? We got another flag right here. Oh, Two flags. This is going to be a false start against the ball club from Hamilton. You know, normally in your first game, you you have you have some t maybe a few turnovers and mistakes and and busted plays and stuff just being the first game. But my gracious, with these penalties. Yeah, tripped up there by uh, number 60 and number 11, Brady Harden. Number 60 is Reed Hamilton, Brady Harden. All right. They got third down at about, uh, that is third down. Or second. Like second down. Right. Second about the, 14? His 13? Head, the line guy over his head was in the number, and I couldn't see if it was a two or a three. So second down, what did you say, about 13? 13, maybe. Yes, sir. Quarterback under center. He running that old wing himself. And it's going to be one of them double reverses. See if we stayed home. He cuts back. He's down to our 45-40. Down to the 38-yard line. Yeah. yeah, they got a first down. It's per tackling on our per tackling on our part. They got a big time first down. And that is going to be the end of the first quarter. A long first quarter, I should say. We have no score in the ball game. Hamilton will have the football first and 10 at the Red Bay Tiger 38-yard line. This is WRMG TV 12 and also Television 97. Keith, I'll be back with you in just a second. I want to tell you our sponsors for the game tonight, including Red Bay Reynolds, located 784 7th Avenue Southwest. Once again, best wishes from Red Bay Reynolds. 15 new units available. They're 10 by 20. Climate control, 24-hour access. Locks are always free. They do have some available units, so make sure you call Johnny. 256-668-0039. By Predator Pest Control, the world-famous Eddie Deaton. Eddie was by our studio this week checking in on us to see if we was ready for a little football. For all your pest control needs, all your termite problems, 21 plus years of business is Predator Pest Control. Also, Red Bay Nutrition Smoothie and Juice Bar. They do a wonderful job. They serve healthy and delicious meal replacements, loaded teas. Everybody is crazy after this. This uh, I, I, I didn't know uh, uh, folks could get uh, crazy over a uh, drink, but boy, these loaded teas and stuff is going over big time. I'm talking about awesome, and you can't beat Red Bay Nutrition Smoothie and Juice Bar. They they take care of uh, everybody in Red Bay. They sponsor the games. They even got a football player out here, Mr. Holden Inman, and thank you all so much. A uh, big shout-out to Sunshine Homes, makers of that uh, 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 Sunshine Homes, builders of quality homes since 1971. The city of Red Bay, the mayor council, your hometown Piggly Wiggly and Ace Hardware owner broadcast. And don't forget about Explore Liquidations, saying good luck to the Tigers tonight from all the management staff of Explore liquidation starting the second quarter we have no score in the ball game red bay and hamilton hamilton with a football and they're on the tiger end of the field gonna run it ball down inside the 35 down to the 34 as will west is in on the tackles and keith pick up about four there they they ran off their left tackle and uh, picked up about four yards there strict man at home down there tonight you think Yes, sir. Is he encouraging them on? That's right. Number 50 just went in for Red Bay. 5-0 for the Tigers. Who is that? 
That's Caden Blancett checking in the game for the Tigers. Second down and about six to go for the first down. They hand it off. Tigers going to stand him up. Oh, yeah. Running that ball there was number four, Taylor, yeah. Dawson number Taylor. Four. Yeah, that's a good play there. Brady Bolton in on the stop. Thank you, Red Bay Hospital on our broadcast tonight. Franklin County Proba Judge Barry Moore, Redmond Heating and Cooling, Patrick Brooks, Redmond Pharmacy, the Red Bay Yacht Club, now open Monday through Friday, 7 to 2, and also Thursday, Friday, and Saturday nights, 4 to 8. Great food, 256 333 4438. And don't forget Red Bay, Archer, Red Bay Acres RV Resorts General Store. Third down and about five quarterbacks. Got a man wide open down the sideline. He's touchdown. into the end zone for a touchdown. Number 11. We do have a flag. They're going to bring that one back, I believe, Keith. Yeah. That flag is at the line of scrimmage. Yeah, they, they just thought they had a touchdown. I don't need an eligible man downfield. Keith, I don't have a number 11, and that was number 11, wasn't it? <laughs> I, I don't know. You liking all these flags tonight, aren't you? It's unbelievable. Marley, have you ever seen as many flags this early in the game? So, so it's going to be it's going to be third down and ten. I'm gonna ask Riley a question. Riley, have you ever seen this many flags this early? You know, that's only this type of thing usually happens week one with every team. I mean, it's 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 gonna happen week one. It's just every you're getting your mistakes, everything's happening. And the ball gonna be pulled down and run inside the 35 to the 34 yard line. It's gonna be a, about it's gonna be fourth and. Fourth and six or seven. Fourth and six. Maybe fourth and five. Fourth and five, I think you are right. Back to 33-yard line, maybe a little over the 33. Thank you, State Center to Larry Stutz on our broadcast here today. Eddie's Collision Repair and Hicks Towing, 332-9090 for all your body and glass repair on 24 East. Big shout out to Congressman Robert Adderholt on our broadcast today, along with the Medical Clinic of Red Bay, Dr. Fabianca. They're going to go for it on fourth from the old wing tee. Got a receiver to the left. They tried to draw us off sides, Keith. I don't think they're going to snap it, and they did not. So it'll be fourth down and five with 9.43 to go. They're going to take a delay of the game and I, punt I the football. I don't understand that. Why don't you just call timeout right before it and then – they may be wanting. They may have a boomer and punter, right? They may want to. They call timeout. Uh, yeah, that's that makes sense there to me. They call timeout before the penalty. Thank you, Fastway Car Wash out on Highway 19, Community Spirit Bank, along with Stadium Pros, Keith Kennedy, Alton Barksdale, that great tasting Carl Lewis sausage, and Keith. Uh, they offer. House lab work and radiology, farm and house calls available. Who am I talking about? Smith Animal Clinic. Dr. Hey, Lindsay Turbeful Smith. I will tell you, I took my dogs over there twice, and they were so busy they couldn't even see them. So I, I had to get smart and get an appointment then. So they're, they're busy. My, you, you know why? They're doing, they're doing a great job. That's it. That's it. Thank you, Lindsay Turbeful Smith, 356 2800, located at 4595. Howie 24, Red Bay. They're open uh, Monday through Friday, 8 to 5. They're closed 12 to 1 for lunch. And they're closed Saturday and Sunday, Smith Animal Clinic. Check them out on Facebook for updates. And also your Edward Jones agent, Mike Jones, is on a broadcast. As we got a timeout with 9.43 to go. No score in the ballgame. No score in the ballgame. Hey, Jack, I've been out in West Arkansas this week. Right. And it's been it's been – it's been a little rainy and overcast, and it's been like 80, 81 degrees. It's right. been pleasant. What are the hogs saying over there? Oh, uh, they're excited. Quarterback back to pass, fourth down and five. Long throw. He's open, and he's got another touchdown. This time it won't be called back. Hit number 11 in stride there, and it'll be a touchdown. For Hamilton. 
So they'll be going for their conversion here. We do not have a number 11. We'll see if we can find out. I think they may have got it over to press box from somebody. I think he got it from their coach down there. Extra points up. It is Ooh, good. Hamilton. No good. No good. It's outside. It is outside. It will not uh, count. Nine to nine thirty-seven to go. Six to nothing is your score. Hamilton leading the Red Bay Tigers. We check and see who number eleven is, if you don't care. Live coverage here from WRMG, brought to you by the Deaton Funeral Home of Red Bay Belmont, by Triple D's Bucket Service, Barney Brandon and Dustin Dick over in Iuka, by David Hester. Uh, he is your District 4 Commissioner on our broadcast. MK Infusion Pharmacy, Missy Montgomery, your honor. She's in Muscle Shows. It's a closed-door pharmacy. They deliver to the patient's home. You can call them at 256-320-7611 by Tiffin Motorhomes. Tiffin Supply, Tiffin Appliance Company by Tristed Insurance. Oh, Kim and Caleb Wells, Mike Moore. Brenda Purser and Christy Mayo, 454-3304 in Belmont, 356-4804 here in Red Bay. When you become a customer of ours, you become family. You got us a number 11 name? McKinley Coplin. McKinley Coplin is number 11's name. You know, when a guy scores two, but they only give him one, he, he deserves his name. So McKinley. Kick off to the Tigers, and the Tigers return up to the 35, breaks the tackle to the 40. 50, down to their 45-yard line. Yeah, that's number 17, Cody Carnes. He got uh, caught it on the 10 and got it to their 45, so that's about that's about 45 yards. Great job. They're going to place it at the 46-yard line right. of Hamilton. We're down 6 to nothing. You got live coverage of Red Bay Tiger football brought to you by Greg Hamilton, your superintendent, Jason Miller, your county commissioner, by Miller's Affordable Furniture, Terry and Jason in Russellville, Alabama, Silver Dollar Bargains down in Golden. They got a new uh, uh, freezer section down there. They also just got in a new shipment of uh, all different types of produce. Bay Diesel and Air Conditioning, Chris and Valerie Marr on the broadcast. Big shout out to Dr. Rick Wooten at Wooten Chiropractic, 301 Jackson. Avenue, Russell, 331-0208. Tigers first down, 10, 46-yard line. And we we're moving. Got another flag. Make sure he's set. Make sure he's set. Tigers not set on that one, and we're going to get a five-yard penalty. Thank you, Bay Health and Wellness. Kayla Humphreys and her staff, 256-376-2036. Go Tigers from Kayla Humphreys and her great staff at Bay Health and Wellness. You know, we're running a little motion and, and the quarterback's not giving them time to get set. And that's that's what's hey, happening. So, for the so, so we just need to pay a little more attention. Hamilton leads by a score of six to nothing over the Red Bay Tigers. We're live at Fred Bostick Junior Memorial Stadium. And we got first and 15. Gonna try to break this on the outside and good break tackle there. He's back and inside the 45, down to about the 41-yard line. Picked up about 10 yards. Keaton Lamphere, I love to watch that kid run the football, don't you? Second about four for the Tigers. Second down and four from the 40-yard line. Number 22 checking in is Holden Inman to bring a play in from the sideline for the Red Bay Tigers. Honored to have you on the broadcast here tonight on WRMG TV 12 and also Television 97. Tigers hand off inside the 40, fumble, and they said he was down at the 37 yard line. Very hard to by number three, Kendra Ford. Six to nothing, Hamilton. We're looking at uh, third down and two yards to go for the first down. Appreciate Katie Johnston, our school board member, making the game possible tonight by Funderflow, commercial and residential pressure washing. Free estimates available from Micah Funderburg. 
662-262-3569. He's licensed, insured, and he's got professional equipment to get the job done. Thunderflow. Tiger's going to run the football, 35-yard line. First He's down. got a community Hard. spirit bank first down. Like you know, you can deposit cash and checks well, right at the ATM first first with community spirit bank spirit deposit. Community spirit bank making our first downs possible here tonight. Keith, we got a lot of folks uh, watching our broadcast. We we'll appreciate them all. Yeah. We got some folks also watching. Uh, Tishomingo County and Alcorn Central. That's really a jamboree game over there, but they kind of playing it like a, the real deal, but uh, kind of get them ready for the season. Somebody wanted to know why we didn't have a uh, spring jamboree. We played a spring game. Oh, great catch there by the Red Bay Tigers yeah. holding in. Oh, that's a great catch. So the Tigers' wonderful catch. The throw just a touch high by Gage Edgman, but boy, that didn't that didn't affect Inman at all as Inman went up and brought it down. So good passing catch there by the Tigers. Don't forget. Yeah, he just Jack, he caught that with his hands and his thumbs turned in like this you're supposed to, and you don't can't teach that. That just comes natural. Community Spirit Bank first down, deposit a check from anywhere with mobile check deposit. They're always got something new coming your way to make things better at Community Spirit Bank inside the 20. Nice little run there by the, the Tigers. Yeah, damn, got about six yards there. Brady Harden running the football. He looks like about second down and four for, yeah, the, for the first down. He's on the, on the 18 yard line. Uh. Tishomingo County leading uh, Alcorn Central 13 to nothing. Just scored again to make it 13 to nothing over there. 6:26 here for halftime. Tigers second down and four to go. Tigers inside the 15, staying on his feet, breaks a tackle to the 10. It's down. Fumble the football. We got it. We got it. We recovered it. Number number one recovered it on the five yard six yard line. Keaton Lamphere recovered yeah. it. We're on the we're on the right inside the six yard line. Was Harden running it down? Yes, he, and, uh, he got down the ten yard line. They jerked it out of his hand. It comes before number one recovered it. I thought I thought I was losing vision out of my other eye, and it was so dark in here I couldn't see. <laughs> yeah. So I thought I might have well turned the light on. Yeah. Appreciate Community Spirit Bank uh, not only making these first downs possible, a big sponsor of the game tonight. Gage Edgman, your quarterback, man in motion. He's going to toss it to the motion man. Five and touchdown! Ten. Touchdown! Red Bay Tigers. Cody Carnes into the end zone. For the Tigers to tie this All game right. up. I'm telling you, young man's got a lot of talent. He he just uh, got out here and got hemmed in on the sideline and just cut it right back like he's supposed to and got in the end zone. Way to go. Keith Adam McGee said you had a front row seat for that fumble. That's it. Renee, <laughs> just right here. Renee Cole, Denisa <laughs> Ivy out there. Uh, I didn't have to ask Rayan, who recovered or nothing. Rayan, I could see it. Rayan and Daxton Cable, Linda Pruitt, Debbie Farr, Rhett Jackson, Emma Beasley out there. Keep sharing, folks. Uh, Susie Keaton says, way to go, Cody. Beverly Winchester Green, go Red Bay. M.D. Walters. Uh, we didn't make it. And the Tigers do not get the two-point conversion, so we've got a tie ball game. Six to six is the score. Um, Ian Abreu McCoy sent out a way, out of boy Carnes. Brenda Elliott and Jack out there with us. So, honored to have you on the broadcast. You know, I got a new neighbor next door at Bay Tree Gift Company. Beverly Winchester Green is a brand new owner. She got all types of gift items uh, for any occasion. We're going to introduce to the cheerleaders for you right now, and we'll be right back with you. Cheerleaders. He's a freshman. We have a freshman, Chloe James. Another freshman, Darali Colbert. Neely Weaver, a sophomore. Jaden Bullard, a sophomore. Nancy Nunez, a junior. Kaylee Moats, a junior. 
Greenlee Hester, a junior. Kinsley Bohannon, a junior. Lexi Howard, a junior. Your co-captain is a junior, Addie Hicks. Allie Hester is a senior. Senior Tally Hamilton. Senior Grace Mason. And your two captains, both are seniors, Sierra Terrell and Olivia Harris. Give these ladies a big hand. There's your Red Bay Tiger cheerleaders doing a wonderful job. And during the timeouts or whatever, we'll share their routines if they're doing a routine during that. But there's we'll there's a lot of them, Jack. Oh, I know it. I can't count that high, but it looks like <laughs> 2, 5, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 16. I'm counting. He got in there as many football players, so we got cheerleaders. Well, they're going to have to. <laughs> we'll have to suit them up here for. We may have to suit them up. All right, we're going to kick off. Red Bay Tigers, number 22, Holden Inman kicking off. Holden kicks off to about to 15. They're back to the 25. Fumble on the play. They run it down, but they lose it again. It. We got the ball. We got it. It's going to be first down Tigers, I believe. Are they going to give it? Oh, oh. Hang on a minute. They're now saying it is Hamilton oh, football. No. That's wrong. They got an injured player down, but uh, they're talking about it. But uh, I'm, I'm assuring you. Can you can you watch that replay? So who gets that ball? Well, I, I'm not using it tonight because we had those other little issues, and I was afraid to chance it. But uh, uh, we can watch it back later and stuff. But uh, I want to say how much we appreciate uh, consider the Lilies uh, making the game possible tonight. Your hometown florist and gift shop for all occasion, a veteran and family owned at 112 Fourth Street, across from the old. Water Tower. Consider the Lilies, of course, providing uh, wonderful merchandise uh, for all occasions. Come in and see Ann and Bree McCoy Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, 9 to 5, 9 to 12. Wednesday, call them at 356-8313. And once again, uh, they do deliver to Deaton Funeral Home in the area, and uh, they really do appreciate your business. Once again, that's Consider the Lilies. We apologize. We got the injured player down for Hamilton out there and hopefully that young man is going to be okay coach is out there uh, checking on it appreciate big star of Red Bay Sunshine Mills makers of that great cat food and dog food by CBNS Bank also Dr. Jim Neighbors and his great staff at the Neighbors Clinic Sunshine Mills what about CBNS Bank Mary Ellen Allen of the crew Franklin Electric Cash and Thermoplastics on our broadcast and also Dr. Brad Gentleman uh, your family medical doctor to show's primary care. Call them at 256-383-4473. Located 340 Cox Boulevard in Sheffield, accepting new patients. Most insurance is accepted. Medicare, Medicaid accepted. Family medical care for all ages. Walk-ins are welcome. Once again, Dr. Brad Gentleman, he married Sierra Hubbard right here from Red Bay. And they really appreciate your business and proud to be supporting these Red Bay Tigers here tonight. Congressman Robert Aderholt is on our broadcast show tonight. Thank you, Congressman Aderholt. He always comes through and wants to sponsor our games. And way to go, Cody. So proud of you and all the Tigers. Thanks, Jack, Keith, and the crew from Miss Brenda Persa, Stevie Creekmore, Randy, and Mariana Ivy out there, Randall Bishop, Brother Billy Nichols, and Miss Jackie out there, Caleb Collins, Mike Jones, your Edward Jones agent, Chris Brazel, Charles Gillian, say go Aggies, Joe Teshner. Did you say, did you say Caleb Collins? Caleb Collins. All right. Hey, we could Caleb. use him out here tonight. That's too. it. Gail, we, uh, Gail we, could, we, need a, we need some numbers. Tom Murray out there with us tonight. Hey, Tom. Y'all do me a favor. Keep sharing this. Get the word out. They're going to do the quick handoff over the 20 up to about the 24-yard line. It'll be second down and about uh, five. five to go for the first down. They're getting a good push on us right there at the, on the start there. but uh, Their quarterback is Mason Holloway. Yeah. They got a receiver to the left out of that old wing tee. 
They're in white, we're in our dark blue, white helmets. They're going to run it to the left side this time. Seth Abels cuts that ball uh, in. Tackle there by uh, 34. Taylor running the football. Jason Vinson, freshman. Jack, what about Jackson? We'll call it Jackson. Yeah. Hey, Jason, you think he, he'd been to be he'd be wore out <laughs> yeah. now? He'd, he'd be needing some air. He'd be waving his hand to come out. Yeah. Six to six is her score. Jack Ivey and Byron Helms. Third and two. Keith Kennedy and Briley Mills here in Red Bay. Six to six, Red Bay and Hamilton. We're in the second quarter with 4:20 to go. Handoff, good run room, 40. Breaks it to the 45 to the 50-yard line. And it'll be first down Aggies. Just shy of the 50-yard line. They're going to mark it all the way back to their own 48. I won't argue with them. I see a 414 here for halftime. Keith, I want to tell you about another great sponsor, Tupelo Eye Clinic, Dr. Ashley Horn Pickery. Now, she's got ties to Belmont. She's got ties to Red Bay. She's uh, located at Tupelo Eye Clinic. That is the place that actually diagnosed when they found that spot on my. And my doctor there, uh, Dr. Chapel, is retired. And Ashley is there now. She does a wonderful job. She's one of her hometown girls. You can call her at 662-844-7211 for an appointment. They offer routine eye exams, glasses, contacts, cataract surgery, exams for diabetes, glaucoma, macular de degeneration, and more. Once again, that number, 844-7211. We got a timeout. Once again, it's Tupelo Eye Clinic right there near the hospital. They got the blue top, so you can't miss it. Make sure you tell them you heard about it right here. If you're looking for some homemade biscuits, maybe one of those five ounce ribeyes with a Texas toast, some of those hand breaded chicken fingers, hamburgers, and much, much more, Joel Page, Jody Nethery, and all the great staff out at Blue Boys has got you covered. Now, you can get gas 24 hours a day. They got the regular, non ethanol, they got diesel. They're open 5 in the morning to 8 at night on Saturday, 8 to 8. The deli's open 5 to 1, but breakfast starts at 5 o'clock in the morning. Blue Boys! On the Ivy Broadcasting Company, we're glad to have those guys on board. Up to about nearly a first down. Thank you once again to Bay Tree Gifts, Beverly Green. And that's Beverly Winchester Green, the brand new owner next door. Second, second and two there. Eight yards on that carry there. We don't need to give up a touchdown. How much time? We need that clock to run 340. They're talking about we may get a clock, a new one, one of these days. Keith, we got to make we sure we fix it where I don't have to hang out the window to see how much time. Another handoff inside <laughs> yeah, the 40 down. down to the 36-yard line. It'll be a first down for Hamilton with plenty of yards to spare. We need to get us one of them remote control clocks so that when we need to speed it up, we can speed it up and slow it down we need to slow it down if you got your yellow flag with you tonight no i ain't got it mary collins with us out there misty hawkham jason wilson jenny huffman watching kelly moore thank you scott mason webster out there lauren sparks charla watson taylor busby robert newell megan l ryan amy robinson saying go aggies chris faulkner out there with us sue helms and running randy mckim janice mcnatt tina brewer Randall yeah. Bishop, we got a lot of folks watching. Yeah, yeah. There's. Uh, it's 2:48 here to go. If you're joining us on our broadcast, honored to have you here today on WRMG TV 12 and also Television 97. This time, another handoff inside the 30 for Hamilton. Uh, That's number 24 running that football. Uh, it's it's going to be third down and two. That's Kevin McBride. This time the handoff to number 24. We stand him up, and he didn't like very much, but uh, he, did, he didn't get it. No, it's going to be fourth and fourth and a half a yard, or fourth 
fourth and fourth and one. Hamilton calls timeout. Tish County leading 14 to nothing over at Tishomingo County, so we got a timeout. Thanks to Alpha Insurance, Mr. John Cook in Red Bay, along with Dickie Sparks and all of his great staff at Sparks CPA. Uh, let's see who else we got uh, sponsoring our game tonight. Also want to thank uh, Dr. Ralph, Nix, Debbie, Karen, Candy, and B. Wish the Tigers good luck tonight. Kim Lindsay does all your screen printing and monogramming. Uh, call her or check her out on Facebook, 256-668-0142. Also, Pro Concert, Terry Hayes. Uh, got you project projectors, screens, TVs, automated camera systems, streaming setups, full line of musical instruments, and much more. Also, Bliss Aesthetics, LLC is your new area to Red Bay. She's very new to Red Bay. You know, that is, of course, uh, the world-famous Beverly uh, Green again. Um, she's located 408 First Street, southwest in Red Bay, specializing in sugar hair removal, individualized skin care, facials, uh, microdermabrasion, and keratin lash lift. Bliff Aesthetics is a space dedicated to inclusion in the community. So if you want to Talk to her, get an appointment, 256-460-9547. You will leave feeling like you're the most rejuvenated self. For bookings, make sure you call Beverly Winchester Green, a licensed esthetician. Is that how you say that? Esthetician. All right. So, oh, first there's a touchdown. run down the sideline, and he is into the touchdown. end zone. Yes, touchdown for Hamilton with a minute and 14 to go. You know, we quit seeing them flags. We had them all yeah. forever. Now when we would like one, we didn't get one. But, uh, of course, I'm sure anything didn't happen on that play. But Hamilton gets on the board. Just uh, about a minute and 20 or so left in the first half. We'll put them six more on the board. They lead 12 to 6 over the Red Bay Tigers. Keith, I know we had uh, the flags was crazy on us there in the first half. But, uh, uh, we're in pretty good shape, uh, even though uh, we're down 12 to 6. It'd be yeah. nice to hold them right here. Yeah, they sure are going to kick it. Today's game brought to you by Casey Lott, your attorney, and he does pharmaceutical product liability cases, personal injuries, and more. They faked it, and they didn't make and it, and they didn't get in. And the Red Bay Tigers it's good play there by Brady Harden and number uh, nine, Eli. Paris, good good play over there. Brady Bolton, number two. So Way good to job, go, guys. guys. So Ferris Bolton and who else did you say? Uh, good job over there. Harden, maybe? Uh I forgot. The world famous Chris Strickland on the sidelines. I hadn't seen him walk a tiger sideline in a few years. It's been a while. He used to play for these Red Bay Tigers. Yeah. There's H. W. Watson Logging Company, Kevin and Harold, the buyers of Timber and Timberland. 256-8108-141. Triple H Electronics, David Humphreys and the crew. Once again, uh, good luck to the Tigers tonight from Abby, Mason, and Leeton. And uh, also, Swamp John's Restaurant and Catering, a full menu plus a daily buffet, pizza on Saturday, located 24247 dine in or carry out. Good hooked on Swamp John's new hours. They're closed uh, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, but they're open 6 in the morning till 7 at night uh, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. So once again, they're closed Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, but they open at 6 o'clock on Thursday. And uh, Thursday and Friday, they're open uh, 6 to 8. And uh, once again, that is Swamp Johns, 356-2300. 25-yard line on the return by the Tigers. He breaks the tackle. That's Keaton Lamphere. He gets up to about the 26, 27. Honored to have you on the broadcast. Thank you, Jonathan Wayne Rogers, Marshall Rogers, Dustin Jones, John Devin Sanderson out there, Melissa Holland, Connie Holt, Mary Collins with us on the broadcast. Uh, Susan Ledbetter, Joseph Dwayne Eads saying go Aggies, Jamie Scott, Kim Bozeman, Mac Nevelin Williams, Josh Southward, Charla Watson says thank you, Taylor Busby out there. Andrea Montgomery, Keith Seahorn, Teddy Humphreys, Jennifer Mason Griffin, and the Tigers right now. Call timeout. Timeout. 
We got a minute and five to go. We're down by six. We're in the second quarter. We're live in Red Bay. Don't forget about the Red Bay Tiger Marching Band plus the Hamilton Band, both performing here at halftime tonight. We'll have that on WRMG TV 12 and also television 97. Thank you, Jason Miller. Jason Miller, your county commissioner, and also Miller's Affordable Furniture, all making the game possible here tonight on WRMG. Big shout out today to Williams Pest Control, Ellis Wooten at Brick Driven Realty, Fancher's Taxidermy, Gary Armstrong, Thompson Gas Company, Bell Haven Heights, another brand new sponsor, Bell Haven Heights Gifts, now open inside the historic hotel Red Bay, 107 4th Street. The owner is Sherry Ferris. And, of course, the current hours, Tuesday, Friday, 10 to 4, Saturday, 9 to 1. She's got a baby and bridal registry available. Bereavement gifts available also. Unique gifts and great finds delivery available, of course, inside the city limits. 356-2200. Congratulations. Bellhaven Heights, your owner once again, Sherry Farish. Brenda Nunley Construction also on her broadcast. Also a banner tire store, Jason 5-H Farms, Donovan and Haley, Sophie Hudson and Harper, CJ's Grocery and Tackle over in Belgreen. Here's the toss to the left to Lamphere. Lamphere to the 30, up to about the 33-yard line. Needs to get to the 36 for the first down. Let me give you the number for CJ's. That number, 256-332-1324. Told you about Williams Pest Control, Tyler Wooten, that number in Belmont, 662-454-3383. Oh, Ellis Wooten, 256 We ain't got but 36 four, seconds. 6-0-0-5-9-8. You'd think we'd have a little urgency about us. We ain't no hurry. No, look at this. We still shifting around. We're going to get a delay of the game. They're going to hand it off to the left side, up to the 35, 37 fumble, fumble on the play. And I believe they may have. Yeah, they, they got it. They got it at our 38 yard line. Wow. That play was doomed from the word go. Didn't look like we uh, had her going there, and uh, yeah. we turn it over. It's uh, 13 seconds left. Tishomingo County still leading in the ball game over there. They got a jamboree going on over at Tish County tonight. Tish right. County leading. And we got Blake Long, Randall, and Josh Mitchell over there. You remember the world famous Josh Mitchell. Long throw down the field. He's got a man out there, catches it, and he's down inside the five-yard line. Six you knew, seconds. You knew they were going to come back to that same play. You know, Jack, I don't when – it, when it's 30 seconds to go before halftime and you're a defensive back, you don't let somebody run by you. Yeah, I mean, that's just, that's just football sense. Right. You don't let somebody run by you. I got a timeout. There's no excuse for that. None. Keith, we're down 12 to 6. Giving up a touchdown <laughs> right here would be devastating, wouldn't it? Yeah, and they get the ball starting the second half. Appreciate Brandon Nunley Construction Company on a broadcast. Thompson Gas, don't forget, 356-2194. Make sure you book it for winter before the time runs out. Also, Barry Cook, CLC, the spray foam insulation man, 256-483-0140. Ronald Thorne, your state farm agent, 356-4459. Dr. Jim Neighbors, Stephen, all the great staff at Neighbors Clinic, 356-9537. Red Bay Pharmacy, Bill and Donna Weatherford, we're families in health care, helping families who need health care. We are Red Bay Pharmacy. Cardinal Drive-In, I could uh, eat one of those. Hot fudge cakes right now. They're going to kick an air field goal, not take a chance. <laughs> Allen and Ash Harden and Harden Heating and Cooling. They put in a York dealer, an American Standard, 356-8913. They have been busy. The field goal is up. Good. No good. He missed it. No good. Boy, we, did we get a break on that one. Oh, my goodness. It's two seconds left. So 12 to 6. I'm sure we're going to kneel down on it. And we'll go to the dressing room, down 12 to 6. But like Keith said, Thank Hamilton you. 
Thank you, somebody. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, good Lord. Red Bay is also a game brought to you tonight by Red Bay Reynolds. Thank you, Mr. Johnny Weatherford, Shannon Oliver, your Franklin County Sheriff. Red Bay Nutrition Smoothie and Juice Bar by Predator Pest Control. Thank you, Mr. Eddie Deaton, Clay, and Ted Weatherford. Sunshine Homes, Builders of Quality Homes since 1971. The City of Red Bay, Piggly Wiggly. Also, Explore Liquidations, Red Bay Hospital, Franklin County Probate Judge Barry Moore by Redmond Heating. Redmont Pharmacy, Red Bay Yacht Club, and Red Bay Acres Resort, State Center to Larry's Touch, also Eddie's Collision as we kneel down on it, and that is the first half. Thank you, Smith Animal Clinic, Medical Clinic of Red Bay, Dr. Fabianchi, that great tasting Carl Louis Sausage, Stadium Pros by Community Spirit Bank, and Fastway Car Wash. Keith? Uh, you might need to go talk to them at halftime. We're going to need some help here in the second <laughs> they, half. Only they, down by six, though. They wouldn't like me, I'm afraid. You wouldn't be not. You would be. You'd be ill. <laughs> they wouldn't like me. <laughs> All right, we'll see you second half. All right? right. Once again, Keith Kennedy on the sideline for the Red Bay Tigers. We got a Hamilton Band coming up in just a second. That'll be followed by the Red Bay Tiger Marching Band. Honored to have you on the broadcast here today. All brought to you by your Edwards Owens agent. You know, Mike has been serving Franklin County and. Tishomingo County, Etiwamba County now for 20 years plus. Stop in his office at 128 North Jackson in Russell, 256-332-7924. Make something into today. Also, Deaton Funeral Home of Red Bay and Belmont, serving the area since 1945. Triple D's Bucket Service by David Hester, your county commissioner for District 4. MK Infusion Pharmacy in Muscle Shoals, Missy Montgomery. Tiffin Motorhomes. Tiffin Supply, Tiffin Appliance Company by Tri-State Insurance. Bay Health and Wellness from Kayla Humphreys and the staff. Dr. Rick Wooten at Wooten Chiropractic. Bay Diesel and Air Conditioning, Chris and Valerie Marr. Silver Dollar Bargains, Miller's Affordable Furniture. Jason Miller, your County Commissioner. Greg Hamilton, your Superintendent. By Casey Johnston, your School Board Member. And also free estimates from Micah. And that is Micah Funderburg from Funderflow. We're gonna send it out on the field now. And we'll have the marching band from Hamilton. That'll be followed by Red Bay. Stay tuned. Hope you enjoy. Morgan Cooper, Oswaldo Wine, Hannah Palmer, Montana White, McKinley Scott, Kylie Bell, Hadley K. Peterson, Kesley Siddham, McKinley Scott, Kylie Bell, and the pit lead Ryan Davis. This evening's performance features Malaguena, Carlos Santana's Evil Ways, and Journeys Any Way You Want It. Drum Major Reagan Davis is your band ready. Now sit back and relax as we present this year's Hamilton Aggie Marching Band.
Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. To our performance here at our very own Boston Junior Stadium, the band is under the leadership of drum major Kaylin Sullivan, percussion captain Brian Williams, wind captain Darby Blancett and Kimberly Barron, majorette captain Ms. Lindsay Miller, and color guard captains are Ms. Lindsay Kanner and Ms. Brianna Martin. Tonight we'll go through classes of the 80s and 70s from hit groups like Journey and the Jackson 5. Major Kaylin Sullivan. Is your band ready for performance? And now on with the show. Soloist Laura Freeland on saxophone, Darby Blanton on trumpet, a rifle duet by Captain Lindsay Tanner and Brianna Markham, and a feature by Major Captain Lindsay Miller.
Thank you for coming out to our performance, and we hope to see you again really soon in the future. The band would like to thank Superintendent Greg Hamilton, Principal Mr. Manny, and Vice Principal Dr. Parson, as well as the Franklin County Board for their support and the opportunity to perform. Make sure to remember a business concession stands to help support this wonderful band program. We're at halftime. This is WRMG TV 12 and also Television 97 serving North Alabama and Northeast Mississippi. Today's game brought to you by Dr. Brad Gentleman. He is your medical doctor at the show's primary care in Sheffield, Alabama, 256-383-4473. Uh, We're at halftime. The Red Bay Tigers twel trail 12-6. to six. And they're coming back out. I think they may put another three minutes up. Uh, so we may have about three or four minutes. I'm going to turn it over to Blally Mills. He's going to tell you about some of our sponsors. Probably we need to finish up there. Then we can start over. And also, uh, you, you don't have to do all of it, okay? All right, here we go. Blally Mills. All right, good evening. We've got a... Uh, we've got a Cash and Thermoplastic sponsoring the broadcast today. Uh, they say good luck, Tigers. We've got Franklin Electric serving Red Bay and Franklin County. We've got CBNS Bank with Miss Mary Ellen and staff. We have Sunshine Mills with their dog food and cat food treats. Big Star with Mr. Hal Keaton and staff. Uh, we have Community Spirit. Then we have. Uh, Mr. Robert Adderholt uh, sponsoring the broadcast today and uh, Blue Boys and the Bottoms on 24 with their 24 hour gas pumps. We have regular, non ethanol, and diesel, diesel gasoline here. We've got the Chipolo Eye Clinic with Dr. Ashley Horn Pickering located at 610 Brunson Drive in Chipolo near the hospital. We have a Spark CPA with six locations located in Red Bay, Iuka, Muscle Shoals, Florence, Boonville, and Corinth. We've got a Alpha Insurance located in downtown Red Bay with Mr. John Cook. Got a, the Dr. Ralph Nix Dentistry. Uh, so cute for you with uh, Miss Kim Lindsay with that. That is located next to Lindsay and Winchester Drapery Company. 
we've got a pro concert with Mr. Uh, Terry Hayes. They they provide uh, church sound systems, and media systems. Uh, Bliss Estisix Est is uh, located in Red Bay, owned by Miss Beverly Green. She's a li licensed esthetician, located at 408 First Street, Red Bay, specializing in sugar hair removal, individualized skin hair, and uh, facial microdermabrasion. It's a new business in Red Bay. Uh, tonight's broadcast is sponsored by personal injury attorney Casey Lott, owner of the largest personal injury firm in Northeast Mississippi. Swamp John's Restaurant and Catering. Uh, call them uh, to for your catering needs. They are open on Thursday through Saturday and also Wednesday. Uh, we've got uh, Triple H Electronics with uh, David Humphries and crew at uh, Triple H Electronics. They support the, our Tigers. We've got uh, H.W. Watson Logging. Kevin and Harold Watson, Highway 9 in Vina, Alabama. If you're looking to sell timber or timber land, uh, there are your go to's there. <clears throat> uh, we've got a Banner Tire store in Fairview Banner Road in Golden, Mississippi. They refill on propane bottles and available, and they can accommodate propane for motorhomes. They also carry the Duck Commander tires, new and used. Uh, we got a 5H Farm sponsoring the broadcast today with uh, Coach Donovan Han, uh, Haley Han, and their kids. They say go Tigers. We've got uh, CJ's Grocery Bait and Tackle over in Bell Green, serving quality food at affordable prices daily, lunch specials Monday to Thursday, and on Fridays they have farm raised catfish fillets plates with slaw and fries. They're open until 6 p.m. Uh, they're open seven days a week with selling BCAA uh, state hunting and fishing licenses. Uh, we've got uh, William Pest Control with uh, Mr. Tyler Wooten. Uh, termite treatments, pre-treatments for new construction builds, general pest control. Uh, he offers monthly, quarterly, bi-monthly, annually, and as-needed services, serving all of North Mississippi and North Alabama. Uh, we've got Ellis Wooten with Brick Driven Realty. is your North Alabama real estate specialist. Contact him at 256-460-0598. We've got uh, Fancher's Taxidermy. And here we are kicking off the second half. The Red Bay Tigers are going to be kicking the ball to the Hamilton Aggies. I'm going to turn this back over to Jack. Jack Ivy Live. Jack Ivy Live. Jack Ivy Live. Well, we have got a 12 to 6 ball game. Thank you. Uh, Daryl Gober checking in. Carol Reynolds, Brad Davis, uh, Fallon Shots Far. We've got Miss Martha Bishop, Maddie Haney. Uh, don't forget the scoreboard is down at the bottom of the screen. Somebody asked him what the score was. So it's right down at the bottom of the screen. Hamilton leads 12 to 6. Uh, JD out there with us. Uh, Zach Sparks and the kickoff by the Tigers. Very short. They'll return it to the 35 up to about the 40. And that's where Hamilton will take over first and 10. Today's game brought to you by Fancher's Taxidermy. Thank you, Jerry Paul and Charlene and Grant. And uh, once again, you can call them at... Uh, 256-460-0404. Your one stop does it all. Reserving memories, making friendships beyond the hunt. Gary Armstrong, thank you so much for being on our broadcast show today. If you need dirt moved or hauled or any type of uh, outside cleanup work done, 256-810-4596. Thank you, Gary Armstrong. First down and 10, and they're over the 40 up to about the 44-yard line. They may mark him a little bit short, but uh, looks like a pickup of about three. It'll be uh, second down and seven. Thank you, Melvin Hutchison, checking in with us. Laura Carden Shamley, good luck, Red Bay and Hamilton Bands. They did a great job. Courtney Hawkham out there, Bretta Ork, Lisa Turberful. Good luck, uh, Tiger Band, Gene Huffman. 
Mackenzie Hester, making sawdust out there, Caitlin Childers, Mark Massey, Greg Thorne, just a few of the folks that are watching us on Facebook Live. Don't forget, we'll upload it to YouTube, and you'll also get to watch this game on TV 12 and TV 97. We'll also replay, replay that Red Bay and, uh, not Red Bay, but Alcorn Central and Tishomingo County game. Third down and three to go there at the Red Bay Tiger 47-yard line. Hamilton, first game of the season, leads 12 to six. We'll have a week off next week and maybe can regroup and uh, see what we need to work on. Penalties have killed us earlier tonight, but uh, we were able to like to give up another touchdown just before the first half. Luckily, they missed that field goal. So we're only down 12 to six, so we need to kind of hold them on this drive. Quarterback hands off 24, breaks it outside. He's got a first down. We're gonna push him back but his forward progress will give him a first down over the 50 down to the Red Bay Tiger 49-yard line. Today's game brought to you by Brandon Nunley Construction Company for all your plumbing, wiring, construction needs. Brandon builds them from the ground up. Got one of those wonderful Tiger cheerleaders down there, 256-412-6500. Also big shout out to Miss Sherry Farish tonight. Uh, she's got a brand new business there in the Hotel Red Bay, Bell Haven Heights Gifts, now open inside the hotel there, 107 4th Avenue Southeast in Red Bay. Current hours are Tuesday through Friday, 10 to 4, Saturday, 9 to 1, baby and bridal registry available, and also bereavement gifts available. Once again, Bell Haven Heights inside Hotel Red Bay. We got a delay of the game against Hamilton. So that'll be first down and 15. You know, it would probably help, Keith, if I turned your microphone on. I, I don't know why I thought I was letting Riley read some stuff up here, and uh, you are with us, aren't you? I'm here. <laughs> You've been wondering the same thing? Just, I just sitting here resting. They was thought, Somebody thought you was on probation. Probably need to be. No. They said you were funny. Mark Massey's out there with us. And the quarterback rolling out the pass, looking downfield. They've had success downfield. This one is overthrown. Uh, uh, we, 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 we had him covered there pretty good. The quarterback sort of overthrew him there a little bit. Don't forget our first downs are being made possible tonight by Community Spirit Bank. We ain't had a lot of them. Need a loan or new checking account, contact a Community Spirit Banker. Get started today. Bank local, bank with Community Spirit Bank. Second down, 15 here, Jack. Third quarter, 9.51 to go. We're down 12 to six. They're gonna bring it to the right side. He cuts it back in. We missed a tackle. They still get him at about the 50. Keith, he's still gonna be looking at about third down and almost 11 to go for the first yeah. down. Well, you, golly, we had him in the backfield and the guy just ducked his head and missed him. Hey, Paul Huffman out there with us. Les Walters, Scott Webster with us, Joe Tesner. We sure need a big play here, Jack. Rick Holliday, we got handsome Joe out there with us. Yeah, we do need a stop. You know, they've been successful on that uh, pass downfield, and we've been yeah. letting them get behind us a little bit, so we need to watch that close. Yeah. They're going to bring a receiver split out to the right side. This time it is uh, number 10. That's Jaden Hatcher. We're going to roll out. We're looking at Hatcher. Now we got a lot of pressure on, and that has got to be. Oh, he's, he's pressure there by. 64, there's got to be grounded. There's if nobody that, in this if in area. Well, that guy was 40 miles down the road. That's got to be intentional grounding. Right. The head guy had to call that one. Yeah. The guy that uh, I would assume supposed to be seeing that over here was motioning downfield. I'm thinking, well, they ain't nothing but blue jerseys there. He, this guy over here, Jack, he's ancient. He's, uh, he wasn't going to call that one. No. So there is going to be an intentional grounding. That's Feature. that's a loss of down too. Yeah. Joey Walker out there. Crystal Walker Rutland. Ed and Bree McCoy. They was wondering if they was going to throw a, a flag on the band at halftime. <laughs> <laughs> I just saw uh, that. All right. That's. It's fourth down in a while. Olivia Oaks out there with us. Kathy Ramirez. Hey, Jack and Keith from Kathy and Michael Ramirez over in Decatur. All right. How y'all doing? We miss them, don't we? We sure do. 
Hey, it's fourth down, Hamilton. They lead 12 to 6, but we're going to get the football pretty good field position here if we'll catch it, and I think this guy is going to catch it. And he fumbled it, but he's going to pick it up and run it. That's Carnes, 35, 40, down the sideline to the 45. They said he stepped out at the 42-yard line. So stepped out of bounds. So we're going to get it first down and 10 as they're on 42. That was a good defensive series there for us, Jack. And so we got to hold on here. We'd love to have you as a sponsor of the game. There's a flag somewhere. You got to be in. Oh, it's against, it's about Russell's sideline morning. Russell? I mean, uh, Hamilton's oh. sideline morning. <laughs> You're shook up tonight. Yeah, yeah. I was reading about Russell here on my phone. Hey, speaking of ancient. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, he's yeah. talking about uh, Alan Harden. Oh, yeah. Thanks. Yeah, he's, he's, he's a good bit older than me. So. There's Peggy Chandler out yeah. here. Mike Engel with us. Make sure you, uh, if you're in Hamilton, make sure you share this. We we love to have all you folks from Hamilton watching the broadcast here in Red Bay. They get it up to about the 41-yard line. We're not going to get any yardage on that one. Brady Bolton running the football for the Tigers. Second down and 11. Cindy Emerson out there with us. Mr. Kenny Sparks, Sheila Smith, DeAndre and Jeremy Anderson, Preston Sides, Paulette Humphreys, Melvin Hutchison, Brad Ivey, Michelle Ray, uh, Sherry James, Brad Davis, Carol Reynolds, Daryl Gober. Boy, we got a lot of folks. Derek and Jennifer McCarla. And also Tina and Randy Sparks out there with us. Folks, you see the score down at the bottom, 12-6, to 6, Hamilton Red Bay's got the football. Maybe we're going to throw the football a little bit. This guy can catch it. That is holding him first down, down to the 45 to the 42-yard line. Yeah. Folks, that is a Community Spirit Bank first down. You know, you can deposit cash and checks right at the ATM with Community Spirit Bank's Spirit Deposit. Keith, I know we've got somebody like Holden Inman, you got Brady Bolton, you got Carnes, you got some guys that can catch that football. And that young guy going in, uh, Braden Tab. So we got some guys. I would like to see us, uh, I know we're uh, more of a run oriented team, but uh, kind of mix it up a little bit. And yeah, we got to be a little diversified. 13 lined up over here on the left side for the Red Bay Tigers, Noah Hester. We'll send a man in motion. He's going to get the football. Lamphere. Lamphere tries to cut it in inside the 40. Breaks the tackle. 35. Down to about the 30. And let's see where this guy marks it. Oh, He's going to mark it at the 32. So that could be another Community Spirit Bank first down. That is another Community Spirit Bank first down. Jack, uh, we had... Uh, 23 yards pass in the first half and uh, about 115 yards of rushing. So about a total offense, 135, 40 yards. So uh, that wasn't real. But we didn't have the ball a lot right. first half. Hamilton had a lot. You can send cash fast with Spirit Pay, person-to-person -person payments from Community Spirit Bank. Mix it up a little bit, get the running room and passing going as well. Inside the 30 down to about the 28-yard line. Number 34 running that football, Jackson Vincent. Jackson, Jackson's got some size, hasn't he? He does. There's Mary Lou Marlin Saint. And Mary Lou and Marlin, we got Gail Scott, Sandra Graham out there with us. Folks, do me a favor if you've not shared it, or even if you shared it before, share this link again. And help us get the word about Red Bay Tiger football and Hamilton. Hamilton leads Red Bay 12 to six, first game of the year. And you got live coverage here on the Ivy Broadcasting Company. Quarterback under center, man in motion. He's gonna get the football, turn it in, and that is number three, Brady, Brady Bolton again. Vasquez in on the stop for Three. Hamilton. It's gonna be third and five. What do you mean, how can I get this? Uh, Michael Hanman. Head baseball coach over at Belmont, checking out a broadcast. Hey, coach. Third down and about five to go for the Red Bay Tigers. Tigers going to send Holden Inman out to the right. Red Bay with 6.06 to go. 
trails 12 to six here in the third quarter. About time for a heat break after this one. They go to Inman, Inman up, it's a little bit too high. Defended by number 10, Jaden Hatcher. Yeah, it's so gonna it's gonna be fourth and five. Fourth and five. Heat timeout, I think. I think you are right. Ladies and gentlemen, we do have a reminder that we will be lowering the flag at the end of the third quarter. They do lower the flag, by the way, at the end of the third quarter. Thank you, Brandon Nully Construction Company on a broadcast tonight. Barry Cook, CLC, spray foam insulation, proud sponsor of Tiger Sports here and all the sports in Franklin County. Call of it 256-483-0140. Dr. Jim and Stephen Neighbors, Neighbors Clinic, Ronald Thorne, your State Farm Agent, 356-4459, Red Bay Pharmacy, Bill and Donna Weatherford, no more driving to Tupelo, Florence, or waiting on Amazon for a lot of those, uh, I guess, uh, favorite workout supplements. You can get them right here in Red Bay at Red Bay Pharmacy and over in Belmont at Belmont Pharmacy. Also, big shout out to the Cardinal Drive-In. I could eat a hot fudge cake, maybe, uh, Banana split. Can you? Uh, well, I can, but I was wondering. You not a diabetic? You don't? Yeah, they increase my medicine, so oh, I can in oh, increase okay. my. I think oh, when okay. they increase your medicine, you they need, added you, another shot, so that means you, you you need more sugar. You need more sugar too. Yeah, uh, it's to offset it, right? That's it. They added another shot on me. All right. Red Bay going for it on fourth down, and you know there's going to be a flag. Yeah. It's Got on the other side. Oh, uh, start. That's three. That's three times. I think maybe on fourth down we were going to go for it or whatever. That we've got uh, penalties, and instead of it being like one yard a couple of times, and it turned out to be six this time, it turns out to from five to ten. Yeah. You know Wilburn Hollis. Thank you, Phoebe Hill Harrison, Trey Bolden out there, uh, Francis Kendall. All right, here we go. Holden Inman is going to be open if we'll get that ball to him. We sent a man in motion. That's Carnes. He might be another go-to. They're going to go to Brady Bolton. He's got it for the Community oh, yeah. Spirit Bank first down All inside right. the 20. Yeah, about, about – uh, he was – that was a good read by our quarterback. Brady was out in the, about the 10 or 12 yard uh, deep flat, and, and he, he was wide open. Made a good throw and a good catch. Way to go. Don't forget to needle, needle, needle on or check an account. Contact the Community Spirit Banker today and get started. And also, you can check them out on social media, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. You know, the head honcho of all the small bankers in the entire country, the chairman right now is Brad Bolton. And that's, Red that's an honor. Oh man. Oh man. He's been speaking all over the country on behalf of the bankers, but boy does that not give good him for, for Red Bay and Community Spirit Bank. Fifteen yard line on the run down to about the eleven he's yard down line. to the eleven. Good end around. He's gonna be a little he's gonna be about about uh, two yards short. Who is that about three yards Brady. That that's Carnes. Carnes Carnes a little slow getting up. Good play, Red Bay from Preston Barksdale. Uh, Sandra Bullen out there with us. Corey Hutchison, Ryan Barksdale with us out there. Randy Elliott, Chris Faulkner. Lori Harden out there with us. Y'all are doing good by sharing this. Cardinals leading uh, that bunch out west one to nothing. Cardinals playing good, aren't they? Uh, uh, how much they had? They had one nothing. One yesterday, 13 to nothing. Yeah, hey. Uh, Janet and I went last Friday night and watched them play Milwaukee. Oh, you did? Yeah, it was, good. It was uh, a good game. Jack and I went up to see them play the Reds a couple of games. Yeah, yeah, we we enjoyed we, it. Yeah, we had a we had a, we had a fun trip. It was watch those Cardinals play. You know, Mr. Donnie Roberts, Coach Donnie Roberts, Miss yeah. Janet watching, Sharon Sparks, Tiffany Lynn Dostica out there checking out our broadcast. Numbers are continuing to grow thanks to all you folks. We got second down. About three. Oh, Mr. Carnes is going to be all right. And, Got about uh, three. Keith, I want you to help me a little bit on some of them big linemen after this play. I see okay. Blancet out there. We've got a man in motion, Lamphere. They're going to toss it to him. Lamphere cuts it, it back. 
He's, he's, inside, four. he's inside the five to the four yard line. Keith, recognize some of those uh, linemen. I see right. Jack West. All right, number 60 uh, is uh, Hamil Mr. Hamilton. Number 56 is uh, Mr. West. Uh, number 50, you've got him. Caden Blancet. And uh, let's see, 64. 64, Jack West. And 66 is Mr. Shot. Shot's out there, and yeah. I saw old uh, Jackson Vincent out there just a minute ago. Who's that coming split to the left towards you there? That's Mr. Uh, number 10. Number 10. You know who that is? That's Braden Town. Braden, I think, uh, uh, he may be a freshman. He is a freshman. We're going to hand it off up the middle. Not any running room there. We may yeah. fall forward and get a yard. Yeah. Well, I'm just hold on the ball. I didn't tell you that other community spirit bank first down. Um, let me tell you about this one. Community Spirit Bank is a proud sponsor of financial literacy in the classroom in 10 area schools, and that's their Money Smart program. Hats off to you, Community Spirit Bank, for bringing that to the classroom. They've got an injured player. And we got a timeout. How much time are there to go? 3.50 to go. 3.50 to go, third quarter. And the Red Bay Tigers right now lead, to, uh, rather trail 12 to 6. Thank you, Stevie Creekmore, Regina Sparks out there with us, Lane uh, Turberful Osborne, uh, Logan Keneal, Mike Jones back with us, uh, Ian and Bree McCoy out there with us, Colton Corn, the Brazzles out there with us. And the Red Bay Tigers. Evelyn Williams asked me something about uh, Swamp Johns. I may have messed that up. It kind of, I don't know where I've got time to find it. Thank you, Predator Pest Control, Red Bay Rentals, Red Bay Nutrition. Hey, Mallory Gordon, uh, Bryant West out there with us. Thank you, Explore Liquidations, Piggly Wiggly, City of Red Bay, Sunshine Homes, Red Bay Hospital, Franklin County Probate Judge Barry Moore, Patrick Brooks at Redmont Heating and Cooling, 279 6569. Red Bay Pharmacy, Red Bay Yacht Club, and Red Bay Acres RV Resort. 80s Collision and Hicks Towing. State Senator Larry Stutz on a broadcast. Smith Animal Clinic. Medical Clinic of Red Bay Dr. Fabianchi. Carl Louis Sausage. Stadium Pros. Community Spirit Bank. Fastway Car Wash. Your Edward Jones agent is Mike Jones. Also, Triple D's Bucket Service, Deaton Funeral Home, David Hester, your county commissioner, Tri-State Insurance, Kim and Caleb Wells, Mike Moore, Brenda Purser, and Christy Mayo, Thank Tiffin Supply, know. Tiffin Appliance Company, Tiffin Motorhomes, Missy Montgomery at MK Infusion, all on our broadcast here today on WRMG. This time, the Tigers are going to run it, keeping it on the ground, and they're down to the two. About the two-yard line. This will be what, third down? Third down. Third down goal from the two-yard line. Gage Edgman coming to the sideline as we're down to 3.23 to go. And uh, are we going to call a timeout here? We've got Edgman over here talking to Holden Inman. We're on the we're on the two yard line, Jack. Just straight up two. Well, we're definitely going to get a uh, five yard penalty here if we ain't careful. We stayed over here on the sideline forever after we it's rung up. Six. And there's a toft to Lamphere. He's in the end zone for a Red Bay Tiger touchdown. <laughs> Keaton Lamphere yeah. on the handoff, the toss from. Gage Edgman. It's hard. It's hard for one guy to hem him up. No doubt about it. it Looks like you're going to the outside and quickly yeah. darted that ball back inside. Hey, Joe Criddle and Randy McCam, Sue and Ronnie Helms, Tanya Bernie checking out with us. Thank you, Alan and Ash Harden at Harden Heating and Cooling, the Cardinal Drive-In. Shannon Oliver, our sheriff. Have you heard anything about Harden, boy? He's probably in bed. It's pretty early, late for oh, him. Oh, he was in the bed by 8 o'clock yeah, tonight. Yeah. Did you know it? Yeah, I know. I was. Tigers going for two. We got a flag. It's overthrown. So maybe it was a good. We got a Motion. false start there. Debbie Farr checking in with us. Mr. Greg. Thank you, Piggly Wiggly, right here in Red Bay, Belmont, Iuka, along with Ace Hardware. City of Red Bay, Sunshine Homes, Red Bay Hospital, Franklin County Probate Judge Barry Moore on a broadcast.
There's Judy Bullen checking in with us. All right. Hey, Miss Judy. It's on the nine, and about nine, eight, nine yard line here. Bliss Aesthetics uh, then is new to Red Bay owner Beverly Green at 408 First Street, Red Bay. We go for it. Two is. point conversion is good to hold an end money. And folks, can you say the Red Bay Tigers have taken a two point lead? Red Bay 14 to 10. Uh, Keith, that was an awesome drive there, wasn't it? That's great. Look at a 408 First Street in Red Bay specializing in sugar hair removal, individualized skin care, facials, microderm abrasion, keratin lash lift as we got the Red Bay Tiger cheerleaders. Let's listen in. Red Bay Band. Yeah. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Yeah, go yeah, go ahead. I think I see something that could be really, really good. What's that? Throwing to number twenty two. Oh yeah. What hands? He's got great old big hands and golly. He he just gets them out there and catches it with his hands and keeps it off his body and arms and that's just the way you do it. No doubt about it. Hey, the number for Bliss Aesthetics with Beverly Winchester Green, 256-460-9547. You'll leave feeling like you've been the most rejuvenated ever, I promise. They're going to run it back to the 30-40. They're going to get it to the 43-yard line. The return that time by number 24, Jackson Ledbetter. So let's play a little defense here. Joe Tester, Kelly Moore, Adam Seahorn, Robert Newell, Rodney Williams, and also Charlene McKinney. Sounding good, Jack, watching from Mom and Dad's house down in the Red Bay, home from down in Tampa. Tracy Elliott checking out our broadcast here tonight. In for the grandkids' birthday. Don't forget Pro Concert uh, down with Terry Hayes. All the churches around here, they use them all the time, put in their sound systems and video. And I highly recommend Terry Hayes. Also, the new sound system here at Red Bay, Terry Hayes. Up to the, about the 46-yard line. We're getting close to the end of the quarter. 2.32 to go. Don't forget, we'll be lowering the flag. 68 the there, Mr. Massey made that tackle. Christy Johnston Thorne, Jesse Norwood Harris watching. Do you know Joe Tester is world famous on Paul Feinbaum? He is? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think, what are they calling him now? Handsome Joe or what? Something like that. <laughs> uh, I, had a, I had a friend from uh, uh, Georgia call me the other day and he was watching and said, Who is that guy? <laughs> Hey, we got third down and about six to go for the first down for Hamilton. They're going to run it to the right side. He cuts it back. We stood him up, and oh, we're going yeah. to stop him. Yeah, good play and there. It, actually, it was second down yeah. instead of third. I apologize. Yeah. There's a whole host of them there, but uh, Eli Ferris, and there's number Noah, number Noah Hester, number 13 on the bottom, number 11 on the bottom, then old 15 there on the bottom. So way to go, guys. It's third down, and uh, call it four. Third and four, you're right. I was just looking at uh, Ferris as a junior, Hester a junior, some of those guys you were calling out then. Keaton Lamphere, he's a junior. Jackson Vincent's only a freshman. Blanchett a junior. The West boys are juniors. Got a man in motion, that's number 11. They're looking to go that way, and he cuts it, and he's got a first down, 45. Down to the 40 to the 38 yard line. Yeah, we we got to we not we don't do a good job of locking our arms up. We get our we got our pads on him, but we don't lock our arms up. And and you gotta you gotta you gotta lock him arms around him when you when you get contact there with him. Jackson up for running the football. Once again, Mason Holiday uh, Holloway, your quarterback. And that was a big first down for Hamilton. They're just inside the 40 at Red Bay. Red Bay leads, look at the bottom of the screen, 14 to 12. Quick handoff, first man through. He's got big running room. Eli Harris got him. More 10 to go. Eli Ferris, 
Misty Ridings ball and hello Jack W. Ivy Jr. Our senior. Go Aggies. A Hamilton alumni. Joseph Baldwin Rare, there's somebody from Hamilton alumni. Can you believe that? Well, we'll have to cut the strings on his guitar. I, I break him there. Yeah. We're, we're kidding, Misty. This time the handoff again, and not much running room as the Tigers push him back. Yeah, he's a whole host of them there. They're saying there's a fumble. He's a ball. Tigers are saying a loose ball, but they ain't. Uh, they not calling it. Every one of our coaches won. Well, this second down. Emily Taylor checking in. Teddy Humphreys. Amanda Lee Reed Mills. Hey, Amanda. Connie Holt with us. Second, second nine. Dustin Lawler checking in with us. We got a lot of folks watching. Thanks to you for sharing it. Please share it right now. They're going to toss it to the right side. He'll cut it back. We had somebody yeah, riding yeah, down. Yeah, Brady Hard, number 11, made the tackle. That's the end of the third quarter. Folks, we do lower the flag, and this is a very, very, very important time in our game when we lower the flag. So, ladies and gentlemen, stay tuned for that. Keith, I'm going to use your microphone, so it'll be on. Kind of turn it that way. Stand in silent respect as we lower our nation's flag. Awesome, a part of Friday Night Lights here in Red Bay, Alabama. Keith, I want to say hats off to the Brandon George family. Brandon, I think Brandon was 39, old, uh, 39 years old. He went to, uh, my son went to school with him, Kyle did, down in Belmont in some of the earlier grades, 4th, 5th, 6th, 7th, 8th, and ninth, those years. And Brandon was uh, killed in an automobile or motorcycle accident this week. And Ooh. what a tribute to him yesterday. Yeah, boy, that's 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 uh, hey, the funeral that's, that's a tough, tough, oh, oh, tough yeah. deal. The funeral procession yesterday from individuals, police cars, ambulances, fire trucks. I mean, it lasted forever and ever and ever. So hats off to the Brandon George family. Y'all yeah. continue to pray for them. Yeah. What about J.C. Vinson? She won some kind of world famous award over here in, in Franklin County. Uh -huh. J.C., congratulations. Yeah. There's Dustin Lawler saying go. Jack and the Go Tigers, Emily uh, Taylor, great job on those taps. Darby Blanson, great job, Darby. Gretchen Davis, Catherine Cantrell Wilkins out there. Shane Joseph Clack, hey Jack and Keith, good to hear some hometown football out here in South Carolina. Kim Bozeman, Susan Ledbetter, Coach Keith for president, Evelyn Williams, John Cleveland, Margaret Viffel. Biffle says she's so proud of her grandson, Eli Ferris. You should be proud of her, Eli. Quarterback back to pass, looking downfield, and I don't know where he, he dropped. Oh, my. I, Somebody didn't cover him. He was wide open. He, I, it's, he just dropped it because yeah. there, there was nobody out there to prevent him from dropping it or even make him think they was going to hit. Great day in the morning. I heard one of the coaches so. Great yelling, yelling for somebody. There's Tim Tiffin checking in with us. Elena McKinney, Brenda Beam out there with us today on WRMG. It's uh, it's going to be fourth and fourth and eight, Jack. Fourth down and eight. They are at the Red Bay Tiger 27-yard line. They got to get down to the 19. Oh, they going to go to the end zone. That's what they've done every time. Quarterback back. We don't give him this much time. He dumps the pass off. We come up, we make the He's not going to make it. No, what a go. First down, Red Bay Tigers. Who made Way to play? go. 
Chat, we got pressure on the quarterback, and he had to get rid of it, and, and we were out there in good position. Way to go, guys. That was a big play. Caden Keaton coming up and making that big play there, Keaton. Yeah. All right. Johnny, Way to go. Way Johnny, to go, defense. Johnny Stockton out there with us. Don't forget Banner Tire Store, 5-H Farms, C&J's or CJ's Grocery over in Bell Green, Alabama, Williams Pest Control, Ellis Wooten at Brick Driven Realty, Fancher's Taxidermy, Gary Armstrong, Thompson Gas Company, Bell Haven Heights Gifts in the hotel in Red Bay. Thank you, Red Bay Pharmacy, Cardinal Drive-In. Red Bay Reynolds along with Predator Pest Control and Shannon Oliver, our Franklin County Sheriff. Folks, we're up by two Tigers. Lamphere breaks a tackle to the 30, up to the 35. He's at the 40, 42 yard line. Folks, he picked up about eight, 17 yards on that run. What a run by Keaton Lamphere, Rick. What an effort, what an effort. What a effort. That's 19 yards. Unreal. So Hamilton wants a timeout. The Tigers. This uh, start of the fourth quarter, already good for the Red Bay Tigers. And we just need to move this. Keith, we don't have, for the folks that join us late, we don't dress out but about maybe 22, and I'm not for sure if maybe 18 of them may be on the varsity scale, but uh, these guys are going to have to be in excellent condition to compete this year. Oh, yeah. So it, far, we have not seen any uh, conditioning issues, have we? I well, we had the one little cramp uh, with, with Carnes, but uh, uh, I want to tell you, um, Joseph Boyd has joined our staff. You know, we used to watch him, and we talked about him earlier. And he's doing a really, really good job getting them in condition uh, and, and lifting weights and do it, getting just getting them uh, so that they can uh, have a lot of durability about them. And uh, so uh, we got to have that because they're going to have to play both ways, most of them. Tish County winning over Alcorn Central tonight, 39 to nothing in a Jamboree game. After the timeout, 42 yard line, first and 10. Gage Edgeman, the quarterback under center from the wing tee. Quarterback back to pass. He's looking for your man and mine too, Holden Inman. Inman to the 45. He's going to be tackled there. He's only going to get about three, but he made that catch. Evelyn Williams, Mac, thank you so much. Francis Cantrell saying go Aggies out there. Randy McKim. Folks, it's an honor to have all you folks that are watching our broadcast. It means a lot to us, I promise you that. Red Bay's got second down and seven to go for the first down. Red Bay's sending Braden Tab split out to the left. Under center, man in motion, here comes Lamphere. Lamphere cuts it. In, back out, he's up to the 50, down to about the 40. He's going to have a first down. That's going to be another Community Spirit Bank first down because he's going to get the spot, and Lamphere is running crazy. Oh, Go. yeah, he's just, he just, it's just one person it takes a, to corral him. He, he just gives great effort. He keeps his legs moving, and, and uh, he, he's built low to the ground. It's hard for those guys to get good shots at him, and uh, so... Just, just makes uh, just a just a good little running back. Make sure you bank with some you know. Bank with the Community Spirit Bank member FDIC since 1908. How old was Brad when that first that first op bank opened up? I don't know. He's pretty young though, wasn't he? I think so. Todd Page says, "Go Aggies!" Hey Jack, Dean Hubbard, uh, checking us out there. We got another one, little cramps here. I believe he's one of the West boys. We have not had much of that tonight, only like the second one, considering how hot and humid it is out there, and especially the first game of the year. Yeah, and just starting and starting, starting and stopping with these uh, plays, it just, it just, uh, 
Uh, number 56 right there. H.W. Watson, Kevin, and Harold on a broadcast tonight. Triple H Electronics, Swamp Johns, also Casey Lott, your attorney on a broadcast. He's a uh, personal injury lawyer, pharmaceutical product, liability cases, and he is one of the best in the business. 662-554-4000. Thank you, Brandy Bolin saying go Aggies. Kathy Lolly out there with us. Veronica Strickland, Shanna Osborne, Michael Stacy Jackson. And the Tigers over the 35. Called a flag. Down to about the, uh, let's see, actually down to about the 42-yard line, but uh, they're going to bring this one back for a false start. Cardinals in the bottom of the second, still leading one to nothing. All right. My, uh, a uh, Sunday? Yes, sir. Blue Holes hit a pinch hit grand slam. Oh, man, I saw that. Didn't I? Pitch. So we got first and 15 now. Ten, ten minutes to go. Playing them Diamondbacks tonight. Here we go. First down at about 16. He puts a pass up. He's got a man out there. And Holden Inman can't run that one down. He kind of got turned around on the pass. So. And that will be yeah, incomplete. Yeah. He just sort of got it on, got it uh, too wide there. Appreciate all you Aggie fans uh, joining us on our Red Bay Tiger broadcast. We broadcast all the Red Bay games on television, Facebook. Most of the time we're on YouTube as well live, but Internet issues, we can't do that tonight. So we've been putting all the Red Bay games on television for, you realize this, since 2001, Keith. 2001, third down and 11, Red Bay drive stalling out a little bit at the 49-yard line. There's Tamara Harris Kelly and Frida Frederick Hudson out there. Justin Scott, Jane Edwards, and Woody. Brandy Bolden out there. Somebody's heat timeout. So we're down in the nine minute mark. Shouldn't be a heat timeout. I don't know what it is. Then. Nine minutes and 16 seconds to go. In the fourth quarter, Red Bay leads 14 to 12. Jack Ivey. Randall Lindsay is not here tonight, but uh, you don't favor Randy Lee. You know, uh, Riley Mills here, and also the world famous Keith. Keith, do me a favor, get a quick word with a strict man right there. All right. We got him right here, Jack. Got the old strict man. Well, what do you think about it? It's good to be home, and it's good to see these kids playing. They may not have a lot of numbers, Keith, but they got one thing. They got heart. All right. You heard it. From the world-famous strict man. Yeah. I don't know what the deal is. Is it a chain issue or what? Yeah, it's a chain issue. Strict's going to go help them. Strict uh, comes in here and <laughs> is going to... He's going to be a chain game man. I believe he's ready to go, ain't he? He is. Byron is getting us a good shot of the strict man. Oh, man, he's coming to the rescue. Somebody's having to leave it there. I think they're having to swap out chain yeah. man. Yeah. Yeah. He's, I don't know, what's happened? I don't know. So we have got a new chain man over yeah. here. Third and 11. So Chris Strickland now on the chain across the way. Third down 11, big play. Lamphere breaks it. 
to the inside down to the 45 yard line. So Lori Deal checking in with us, John Matson, Phyllis Williams, Ashlyn Deaton out there, Randall Lindsay, Justin Scott, Red Bay leads 14 to 12. And we'll have fourth down here. I'm going to assume we're going to punt this ball away and not give them the football here close to midfield. Dr. Stephen Ray on a broadcast. Do me a favor. We got a lot of folks watching right now. If we're every, fixing to get a delay of the game. If every one of you shared it right now, and I promise you, we need all those yardage to punt. Yeah, he called timeout. We just barely got it in timeout because it. All right, we got a timeout. Let's double check the time. I have to lean my head out the window. Eight it's, minutes and twelve seconds. They've promised me when they do a new uh, clock, they're going to at least move it around so we can see it without having to hang out. Yeah. Makes it pretty difficult. Oh, there. yeah. When we were, for a long time, it was on the other end of the stadium. Right. I wouldn't mind it being right under that corner by the home uh, dugout for the softball. Boy, I could yeah. see it great. That'd right be there. perfect, wouldn't it? Oh, it'd be perfect. Hey, get the beach. Hey, I've done got it rigged up so we can send them video out. And they can put our video out there if they want to at whatever time they want to. All right. <laughs> don't forget contactless payments available via Apple and Android Pay. And don't forget, uh, we hope to have our instant replay going next time. Brought to you by Alpha Insurance. Kicking for the Red Bay Tigers, Reed Hamilton. Riley, we got our work cut out to get a win here, don't we? We do. Got to gotta, gotta play defense. They do not have anybody back. So if we could get a... Good punt, now they're gonna back somebody up. He gets that kick off. Pretty good little kick down to about the 15 yard line. He's back to the 20. Run him down, stop him, he cuts it in up to the 25 yard yeah, line. He's gonna be first and 10 on the 25. Lamp fear there, and uh, Brady Harden comes up hobbling a little bit over there. Checking out for the Red Bay Tigers here. Caden Blancett coming to this sideline. Big number 66, John Schatz. Here comes 17, Cody Carnes. Caden Lamphier. These guys got to be wore out. Carnes just uh, fell down to the ground when he got over here. He's, I think he may be cramping up a little bit. Mm. Quarterback under center for Hamilton. We're up by two. They hand off over the 25 to the 27. They do have a field goal kicker. Yeah. Yeah. That's uh, picked up about picked up about three yards. There was a tackle in there, but look, I think one of the West boys. We got them West boys back another year, Key. Yeah. Appreciate Dr. Fabianchi and also Smith's Animal Clinic on our broadcast here today. Your Edward Jones agent, Mike Jones. Deaton Funeral Home, David Hester, County Commissioner. Quarterback rolling out. Little dumps a pass up to the 32. 35. We're going to ride him down at the 37. Good job there by Caden Keaton to ride him down, but he's. Uh, going to have another first down. Yeah. I bet Strick could get him right over there. Yeah, yeah he will. Thank you, Dr. Brad Gentleman at Shoals Primary Care on a broadcast. Community Spirit Bank, Big Star, Sunshine Meals, Franklin Electric, Cash and Thermal Plastics. Also, CBNS Bank, Congressman Robert Adderholt, and also Blue Boys. Thank you, Joel Page, Jody Nethery. I need some of them homemade biscuits right now. Hand off 40, 45, up to the 49. He's got another first down. Wanda Schubert checking in out. Tony Grubbs. Game easing on down. 6.40 to go. We'll probably have a heat timeout maybe after the next play. They do have a first down. Thank you, Chippewa Eye Clinic. Dr. Ashley Horn Pickering. Located 610 Brunson Drive near the hospital. 
cataract surgery, exams for diabetes, glaucoma, macular degeneration, just routine eyeglasses, uh, eye exams, contacts. And folks, she has got all kinds of ties to Belmont and Red Bay. Dr. Ashley Horn Pickering. Make sure you call her for an appointment. She'll do a wonderful job. Let me give you the number, 662-844-7211. Keith, they're getting about five a pop, aren't they? They got four then, it'll be second down and four. Yeah. Second down and six. Second down and six, he got four, okay. Baytree Gifts, Beverly Winchester Green, right next door to WRMG. Has got your baby and bridal registry, all types of gift items. Going to be adding tons of new items. Spark CPA, Alpha Insurance, Dr. Ralph Nixon, Kim Lindsay, all on our broadcast today. This time we hit him. Yeah, that's tackled there by about 45. Number 66 there. That Mr. Shots. Shots. Yeah. Mr. Shots. Also, Beverly's got Bliss Aesthetics. Uh, she's located at 408 First Street Southwest. And she believes that self-care is for all genders, races, and religions and are welcome. Very proud to serve the Red Bay area. She strives to provide services to and cultivate a safe, calming space to relax and escape from the chaos of everyday life. You'll be leaving feeling the most rejuvenated self for bookings 256, we got a heat timeout, 256-460-9547. Also big shout out to Casey Lott, your attorney at law, Swamp Johns, Triple H Electronics, HW Watch and Logging Company. I'm gonna go over those hours again. I think I botched them up earlier. Get hooked on Swamp Johns. They're closed on Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Miss Evelyn, closed on Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. They are open on Thursday. Uh, looks like Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Uh, Thursday and Friday, 6 to 7. And on Saturday, 6 to 8. And you know they got some awesome food there. Don't forget now, the chicken on the stick has been moved to Friday. Fish is still on Thursday. Also, they got a buffet after church on Sunday, which is really, really good. Quarterback back to pass, looks, dump off a pass. We miss a tackle, but finally get a hold of him and drag him down at about the 32, 33 yard line. 14 to 12. What? No, no, you can't break the huddle Coach getting after him. What was it? Broke the huddle with more? Yeah, they had 12. Yeah. You can't break the huddle with 12. That's first down and 10 there at the Red Bay Tiger 32 yard line with 5.14 to go. The handoff this time, the cut back to the middle. He's down to the 15 yard line before we get him. Maybe at the 14 yard yeah. line. A little mixed direction there. Jamal Anderson checking in with us. We got Annalise Rogers at New Northeast Tiger, Carla Bolton Wright, Charla Lucas. Uh, we got Preston Barksdale, Ty Nichols with us out there, Brett Williams. We got another injured player, Misty Hawkham checking in with us, Mr. Clint. Thank you, H.W. Watson Logging Company, Kevin and Harold, Triple H Electronics, Banner Tire Store, 5-H Farms, Donovan, Haley, Sophie Hudson, and Harper, C.J.'s Grocery, Williams Pest Control, Ellis Wooten at Brick Driven Realty, Fancher's Taxidermy on our broadcast here today. Also, Gary Armstrong, it does all you doze your backhoe work, Thompson Gas Company, you need to book it so you get the best price right now, 356-2194. Bellhaven Heights Gifts inside the Hotel Red Bay. Sherry Ferris, your owner. Brandon Nunley Construction Company, Barry Cook Spray Foam Insulation. Also, Ronald Thorne, your State Farm agent, and my Neighbors Clinic, all on the broadcast. They're keeping it on the ground. Great yeah, job. Yeah, there's the 64 there. And, Mr. Uh, Mr. Jack West. Yeah, that's no game. Thank you, Shane. Joseph Clack checking in with us out there. Appreciate you joining us here tonight on WRMG TV 12 and also Television 97. Thank you, Janice Collum. I just got through talking about old Ellis Wooten there. Mark Massey checking in with us. Appreciate Red Bay Pharmacy building down the weather for the Cardinal Drive-In and Harden Heating and Cooling on our broadcast. This time they 
Run goes to the right side. We got a flag on the play. Keith, we may get a break and uh, yeah, bring this one back. a little hold there. Holding. Gage Edwin coming into the ball game. Shots will check out. We're down to four, four eighteen to go. We're ahead fourteen to twelve. Cardinals still up one to nothing out in Arizona. Oh, Goldsmith hit a home run. Is he going to be the MVP? If he keeps the pace up, he will be. He hit one. We were there Friday night. He hit one Friday night. Do you have some pretty good seats? <laughs> right by the dugout. Right by the dugout. Yeah. Hey, I'm going to tell you what. They've been drawing big, ain't they? Oh, there's 46,000 there. Not with us. Second and fifth, uh, tw 25. And right up the middle, the he's going for a touchdown. He broke the line of scrimmage and took it all the way in for the touchdown. So from almost 25 yards out. Yeah, it's 25. And thank you, Robbie Comer, or Janice Collum, Ellis Wooten, making sawdust back with us. And we'll have to put up another six there. It's 18 to 14, Hamilton. They'll score with 352 to go. 352 to go. If you're joining us on a broadcast, honored to have you here today on WRMG. TV 12 and also television 97. Keith, they're going to go for two. Go right for here. two. They do have a receiver to the left in that wing tee there for your quarterback, Mr. Holloway. Rolling out to the right. He's going to pull it down, sees the corner of the Touchdown. end zone. No, he called it, called it good. So the two-point conversion is good, and that will make it 20 to 14 Hamilton. All we need, Keith, come back down this way if you don't care. All we need is a touchdown and a field goal or extra point to uh, pull this thing out. we got time. Of course, we're strictly a running team uh, most of the time, but we can throw the football. We know we got some guys we can throw it to, so maybe – we might do that 20 to 14. We may just uh, not, uh, we may have to, right, Keith? That's it. We need to run this kickoff back. That'd be nice. Red Bay Reynolds, thank you, Johnny Weatherford, Shannon Oliver, Predator Pest Control, thank you, Eddie Deaton. Red Bay Nutrition on our broadcast here today. Uh, Sunshine Homes, the city of Red Bay, Piggly Wiggly, Explore Liquidations, along with the Red Bay Hospital, Franklin County Probate Judge Barry Moore, Patrick Brooks at Redmond Heating, and cooling redmont pharmacy also the red bay yacht club and red bay acres resort state senator larry stutz 80s collision on our broadcast smith animal clinic medical clinic of red bay thank you fastway car wash community spirit bank stadium pros we got that great tasting carl louis sausage on our broadcast also on our broadcast here today is your edward jones agent mike jones serving franklin tishomingo and etowamba county now for over 20 years there's a kickoff down the middle. Tigers pick it up, take it to the left side, cuts it back to the 30, 35 up to about the 38 yard line. Keith will have it first down and 10. First yeah, that's Mr. Mr. Tabs there. Way to go, number 10. Way to hustle. He's going to be a player. Yeah, he picked it up, went north and south. You locked that. Courtney Hawkham out there with us. Keith Seahorn checking her broadcast out. Red Bay Tigers trail 20 to 14. Keith, we're 61 yards away from a touchdown, which would tie it up. And then we'd need an extra point to win this thing if we could do it. Cassandra Chambly out there with us. We're under center, wing T with a receiver to the left. And we're gonna run Lamphere, 40, 45, 50. Down to the sideline to the 40, to the 40. Two yard line, Keaton Lamphere with a Community Spirit Bank first down. Don't forget, uh, send cash fats with Spirit Pay. Person to person, you can deposit a check from anywhere with mobile check deposit. Community Spirit Bank, folks. Red Bay, two locations, Vila, Russellville, and Belmont, Mississippi. That's a good good start there, Jack. I, I saw Miss. I saw Mr. Billy and Miss Judy last night getting, All little, right. getting a little late yeah. down at 4th Street. Yes, sir. They're back open and uh, 
As good as always. Here we go. First down, Tigers 41 yard line. Lamphere again, 40. He's got five. He's got eight more down to the 32 yard line. He's tenth. He got a first down. I hope so. I well, I don't know. They they're they, gonna spot him no, short. Yeah, I'm gonna spot him a little short. Keaton Lamphere. The clock running with three minutes to go. We got a great drive going right here. We're down 20 to 14 to Hamilton, Alabama. And we have got a, what have we got? Timeout? Yeah, we coming to measure, I think. Now they say first down. First down. Huh? I didn't think it was first down, I'll be honest with you. You know, we'll take it, won't we? Oh, yeah. Check out Community Spirit Bank on social media. They got you covered on Facebook. They're on uh, Instagram. They're on Twitter. Need any long contact a Community Spirit Bank starter and get started today. Quick handoff. So we got a whistle as number 11 would it was taking it for big yardage, Brady Harden. But we're going to get one of those penalties that puts a herd in a drive, Key. Yeah. It's going to be first and 15. First and 15, 20 to 14 to Hamilton. Thank you. We're not, we're not, the quarterback, he's getting in a hurry. He's not giving us time. When we go in motion, he's not time. When we go in, you have to get set for a count. And he's he's starting to play before he's been set for a count. So that's that's what's happening. And we just keep repeating it. Tabs into the ball game. Your Edward Jones agent, Mike Jones, and Deaton Funeral Home, David Hester, County Commissioner. MK Infusion Pharmacy, Missy Montgomery, Tiffin Motorhomes, Tiffin Supply. What about Tristead Insurance? Bay Health and Wellness, Kayla. We got a pass way too high intended for tabs. That was on first and 15. Think, yeah. Two twenty-eight, Jack. Second and 15. We're on the 32-yard line. Old and Inman bringing in that play from the sideline. Did he bring 37-yard line? Did he, did he bring his own number in? It's possible, right? It's possible. I think we're going to run it. And we fell down, and his knee went down. Yeah. And we're going to lose a yard or two. We slipped down a little bit, and his knee went down. We got uh, some players that's hobbling out there. One of them being uh, 56, Mr. Will West. Riley Mills with us up here in the box tonight. Next we game. need a big play, Jack. Good Lord willing, we're going to have a sideline camera, wireless. Third and 17. It's big right here, isn't it? Third down yeah. and 17, 20 to 14, we're down. By a minute 44 to go. Call time out. Red Bay calls the timeout. Coach Childers knows how big a play this is. Yeah. And we're going to see exactly if he stays with the call or not. We'll get an interview with the coach after the game is over, after he talks to the team just a little bit. Thank you, Miller's Affordable Furniture, Silver Dollar Bargains. Located down in Golden, got that new freezer cooler down there full of great, great items. Over in Hamilton, Bexar Avenue, Cliff Gookin and Chibolo, Silver Dollar Bargain, 75 Golden Road, Golden, right there in the curve. Also, Bay Diesel and Air Conditioning, Chris and Valerie Marr on our broadcast, Dr. Rick Wooten at Wooten Chiropractic. Whether it's injuries, drug and alcohol testing, DOT testing, he does it all for you. Greg Hamilton, our superintendent of education, Jason Miller, our county commissioner, Casey Johnston, our school board member by Micah Funderburk, your owner of Funderflow Commercial and Residential Pressure Washing. Call 662-262-3569. Remember, he's licensed, insured, and he's got very good equipment. He does it great. Here we go, third down and 17. Quarterback Lowland. He looks, goes across the middle, throws it behind the intended receiver. I wish he could have got into position to put it downfield mm. to Holden Inman. Holden was uh, breaking loose back there, and I might, he, he might could have Bra run. Brady Bolton was open. Over here on the right side, too, right? Yes. Fourth he, and 17. He was being pressured big time, Keith. Taps yep. will bring in a play. 
minute 39 to go. We're down by six to Hamilton, 20 to 14 on our first game of the season. First game of the season. Inman is going to the right side. And looks like Hamilton, Hamilton, calls time. Hamilton wants to talk it over. So Hamilton wants to talk it over. Big shout out to uh, all these people that have made the game possible tonight, like Big Star, Sunshine Mills, along with CBNS Bank, Franklin Electric, Cash and Thermoplastics. Thank you, Chuck. Also, Dr. Brad Gentleman, your family medical doctor at Shoals Primary Care. 256-383-4473. On-site x-rays, EKGs, blood work. MRI, CT scans, stress tech, uh, stress test, echoes. Dr. Gentleman has privileges at Helen Keller and Shoals Hospital. Graduate of Cherokee, University of Alabama and UAB Medical School. All ages are welcome, walk-ins, accepting most patients or accepting new patients, most insurances as well, Medicare, Medicaid. He married uh, World famous Sierra Hubbard down in Red Bay. Thank you, Dr. Brad and Sierra and the great staff at Shoals Primary Care. Quarterback back to pass. He lays it up. He's got a catch pass. Can, can he roll it forward down. to a first down? He catches it now, a flag. That's gonna go against Hamilton, I believe. Yeah. yeah. He caught it and I believe he's gonna have the first down. Yeah, he's got the first down. So that'll be another Community Spirit Bank first down to hold an inman, and then they're going to get an unsportsmanlike. You know, you can check out Community Spirit a lot of places. That's, that's, a, that's a personal file. Yeah, I know. That's De 15 yards. Deposit cash and checks right at the ATM with Community Spirit Bank Spirit Deposit. We're down to a minute 32 to go. Tigers have new life, Keith. Yeah. Well, it's 10 yards. So it's first and 10. Well, it's just right outside the 10. Would it have been 15 if it had been anywhere else on the field? Is it half a distance or something like that? Yes, yeah, I guess it's half the distance. Tabs will bring it into play from the sideline. The clock will run 126 to go. Play of the night right there. What, about a, Lam so. what about a Lamphere touchdown right here? I'd like to run maybe two plays. Oh, okay. Here we go. We're going to go to Lamphere. He cuts it back to the middle and picks He's up some yard. He's inside he sounds the 10. about the six. Six yard line. Red Bay maybe Tigers. Se maybe seven. 103 to go. Inman bringing it into play from the sideline. Community Spirit Bank making our first down spot of in member FDIC. Great ball game, isn't it? Caleb Collins back with us. Terry Reed, Jonathan Kirk, Tony Massey, Preston Sides. Wesley Wilcher, Chloe Kelton. Tigers down to about the three yard line. Down to the two yard line. They're going to say the two. Third and a one yard, and we're going to get a timeout. Yes. Red Bay's going to get a timeout. 35 seconds to go. 20 to 14, Hamilton. But the Tigers are threatening here at Fred Bossett Junior Memorial Stadium. Hey, Miss Carol Reynolds, Hope Jackson, Brad Davis, Helen Harris. Uh, Matty Haney, Cindy Emerson out there with us as well. Keith, awesome drive here with the Tigers. It oh, looked, yeah, looked, and, and Jack, these guys are worn out, you know. Oh, I know. They're, it. they're, they're this is a lot of, they're just, this is a lot, just all desire. And uh, so that's, uh, we just got to, got to get uh, two yards and got two plays to get two yards. We'll let Anandley out there with us. Mike Engel with us out there on our broadcast as well. We have got Keith set it up third down and a yard to go. And we can get a first down. I'd rather not mess with a first down and go in and score, but 35 seconds to go. All right, Jack. Red Bay Tigers. Harden back there in the backfield. Here's Lamp here. On the toss back to Lamphere, they hit him deep. He falls down and he is awful close to the first he's down. Inside the one yard line. He's inside, so he should have the first down. Is that, or is uh, it? Well, that's going. The first down marker is inside. Know. It's inside the one, isn't it? Yeah, it's it's. They're going to measure. 
So the clock is stopped. They're going to measure it. 29 seconds to go. If we don't have the first down, it'll be fourth down. Yeah, I, I in, don't. Inside the one. I really don't think we have it, but I can't just really tell. You know, they should have had him in the backfield, shouldn't they? Oh, yeah. But Lamphere, there's Kenny Nichols checking in with us. Hannah Haddock, uh, Sandra Sparks with us, Tamara Kelly, Jeanette Pearson with us. Uh, Folks, it's an honor to have all you folks watching us tonight. Remember, you can go back and watch this and in its entirety on Facebook tonight. I'll have it up on YouTube for you tomorrow. We'll show it on television. Here's the measurement for the first down. We got you a great shot. We'll let you look as we look. They stretch it out. First down. First down, Red Bay Tigers. Thank you, Cindy e Cynthia Ezel checking in with us. Kenny Nichols out there with us. We have got first down and goal. We 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 had a first down by about an inch and a half, maybe two inches. Twenty nine seconds. Move. How many timeouts we got? I don't know. Hopefully, we got at least one. I would step over and quarterback sneak and run over my guard. We hadn't done it all night, so maybe they're not expecting. We're going to go to Lamphere. Lamphere cuts that ball in. Touchdown, Red Bay Tigers! Touchdown, Tigers! We'll put the six up, and we've got a tie ball game. Now we got to get a extra point or a conversion to win this ball game here in Red Bay. We're down to 22 seconds to go. Yeah. You know who's been kicking, don't you? Now, I don't know who will no. let him kick tonight. It's holding in. No. But I don't. I don't it. think we're gonna kick. There's Inman coming in, and of course our quarterback's coming in. We're gonna we're gonna run it, and Inman's gonna go split out to left. Thank you, Beverly Green, with our broadcast here tonight. We're going for two, and hopefully the win. Tigers drop back to pass. Inman's wide open. Two point conversion is good. The Red Bay Tigers lead 22 to 20. And pandemonium setting in here at Fred Boston Junior Memorial Stadium. But folks, it's not over. We're down to 22 seconds to go. Red Bay leads Hamilton 22 to 20. What well, a game, Keith. Yeah, he, uh, they, uh, they listen. Throw it over to Mr. Inman. Man, okay. and he was open, wasn't he? Big oh, man, wasn't in close. Sandra Graham checking in her broadcast. You like that, don't you? Let's listen into that Tiger band, the cheerleaders. Red Bay Tiger football is a production of the Ivy Broadcasting Company. I'm Jack Ivy, Keith Kennedy on the sideline, Briley Mills right beside me next door, giving you that great video of Byron Helens. Well, let me ask this, Jack. Would you squib it or would you keep it, kick it deep? Ooh, I don't know. I've seen us try to squib it before and it was like an onside kick. Uh, I would, I would kick her deep. I would too. Because that's going to run more clock off the play. Off holding them in running it back. But. Holding in to kick off for the Tigers. 22 seconds, Keith. 22 20. Red Bay leads. And he kicks it right to number, I don't know what he is, but he got it at 30. He's back to the 40. And we get him at the, on the 41 yard, yard line. That return was by 17 number four, seconds. Dawson Taylor. 17 seconds to go. Now they've shown success throwing the football long. Yeah. So we're gonna have to get our defensive backs back. Thank you, Mary Lou and Marlon St. Gail Scott out there with us. Folks, do me a favor. Make sure you let your friends and neighbors know all of our games are on Facebook. Most of the time, if it's on the road, we'll have it Facebook and YouTube. I'll replay this on television tonight and tomorrow, and we'll upload it to YouTube for you as well. And you Hamilton folks, thank you so much for watching tonight. And it's been an honor to have you folks watching with us. Uh, just keep everything in front of you. Got an outstanding program. And their quarterback is 
Holloway under signal at the 42-yard line. He's back to pass, looking downfield. He's got a man behind us, but we almost intercepted him. Keith, he was behind us by five yards. Yeah. Wow, if the pass had been longer, now there is going to be a flag at the 50-yard line. It's going to be against Hamilton. Thank you, Barry Cook, CLC Insulation. Checking out our broadcast. You need that spray foam insulation. Barry Cook is the man to see. We've had some really, really great numbers of folks watching tonight. Congratulations, Tish County. They won their jamboree tonight. Right now, the Red Bay Tigers, what a game. 22 to 20, over 40. 11, 11 seconds, Jack. That moves it back to about the 37-yard line, maybe 37 and a half. Thank you, Sunshine Mills, on our broadcast today. Robert Adderholt and Blue Boys across the bottom. Thank you, Joel Page and Jody Nethery. Got them homemade biscuits early in the morning. Quarterback back to pass, looking. Throws it up downfield and enters incomplete. Down at the 38-yard line. Their guy is cramping up, so that's going to stop the action just for a second. Keith, we're down to seven seconds to go. We're seven seconds away from a win. Phoebe Harrison, thank you. Toby Gray, Tammy McAlpin, thank you for being out there with us. Keith and Ivy's Cardinals still up one to nothing out yeah. of the Diamondbacks tonight. Yeah, they got three games out there. Don't forget, uh, consider the Lilies. Ian and Bree McCoy, big sponsors of the game tonight, and uh, we appreciate them being on our broadcast. If you're out there joining us, thank you so much for being a part of our broadcast here tonight on the Ivy Broadcasting Company. They do deliver uh, to Deaton Funeral Home in the surrounding areas, fresh and artificial floral arrangements, gifts, and a huge candle selection. They're open Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday, 9 to 5, and on Wednesday, 9 to 12, a uh, veteran and family owned it, of course, right there in downtown Red Bay at 112 4th Street. Make sure you tell them you, Jack Ivey sent you that way. Once again, consider the Lilies, your hometown florist and gift shop in Red Bay. Ian and uh, Brianna McCoy, 356-8313. Thank you, guys. Keith, are we looking at what, third down? I can't see it. Really. Yeah, it's it's uh it's third. No, it's second down. And they already thrown two passes. One well, of them was, was a penalty. penalty. Yeah, yeah. that's right. Second down. And seven seconds. This more than likely will be the last play. Their guy being helped off over there had cramp. With their own 37 and a half yard line. Seven seconds to go. Red Bay, as you see at the bottom of the screen, leads 22 to 20. Thank all you brand new. And new, uh, brand new, and the ones that's been with us, cheerleaders, band members, got a lot of new folks on the football field and everywhere. A lot of new students uh, moving up to high school and starting school. Glad to have you here tonight. Quarterback back to pass. We flush him out of the pocket. He's looking. We got 34 after him. We may sack him back there. He's coming back this way. 25. Looks downfield. We're going to. He's going to throw it down there. He, they got a man behind us. He catches the football, and we tackle him at the 15-yard line. And that's the ball game. Wow, how did he get behind us? I don't know. But the Red Bay Tigers have won the game 22-20, an outstanding job by their quarterback. Uh, he just kept going around and around and around, Mason Holloway. I, I don't understand these boys letting them boys get behind them. I, I don't understand that. Uh, you got to turn around and see where the guy's at. I, I, I you know he's fixing to throw it deep. I, I don't understand. And uh, what a win here tonight. Twenty. That's a great to win. Oh, yeah. Keith, these guys, you said they're wore out. Lots of hard. Yeah, I, these. Well, I, when, when, they, when Hamilton scored that touchdown with 352 to go, I, I, I didn't give us a lot of hope because we were so tired and wore out. But uh, we come back and won. No doubt about it. Honored to have you on the broadcast here tonight. If Red Bay wins, this will be the first time Red Bay has beat Hamilton. Red Bay's got a COVID forfeit win against them, but if Red Bay wins, and we did, uh, this will be the first time Red Bay has beat Hamilton. I didn't know that. Did you know that? No, sir. You heard it first right here from Byron Helms. 
you know, Byron uh, is on top of it, isn't he? Thank all you folks for out there watching the broadcast tonight. As the Red Bay Tigers are victorious, once again, the final score, 22 to 20, 22 to 20. Unreal. Thank everybody for watching tonight, folks. We couldn't have made it without you. Hopefully our broadcast sounded okay and looked okay for you. We had a little buzz there earlier. I'm not sure why, but uh, hopefully that didn't mess you up from enjoying the broadcast. And uh, Red Bay is going to meet over here at the sideline. Where's Coach at? Uh, he's, hey, grab him if we can before they uh, – hey, Keith, there he comes behind you. Grab him, and we'll get out of here. Once again, the Red Bay Tigers – Winning over Hamill tonight by a score of 22 to 20. There's a lot of hugging going on right now. All right, Keith, Keith is Coach, standing by. what do you think about that? Well, I, I, I'm, I'm speechless. Well, you know, I was tell, I told Jack, I said, when they scored that touchdown with, and we had 352 to go, our boys were war. And, I mean, that was just all heart coming down that last drive. It was. And I, I think that was uh, – Reflection of you guys, the way how hard y'all worked, and and uh, you know basically playing two ways ever play, and that's that's awful tough in today's world. It, it is, and uh, we had a lot of guys that went down tonight. You know some, you know Kyler Watson wasn't able to go in the second half, and he's a huge part of of what we do. Right. Uh, we, Cody Carnes was cramping. Uh, you know they, you know the the guys have they they worked hard. And, yeah, uh, I, I and they that. fought hard tonight, and they deserved this win. That's they right. they won because they deserved to. That's right. And, and it, they uh, these are things. Hold on, say, hey, coach, coach, tell them they can get any picture they want made with their parents. <laughs> hey, they can take but you know these are these are things that last them their whole lifetime. They'll you know, always get, remember yeah, this. Yeah, getting knocked down and coming back, and yeah, this will be for a lifetime. And congratulations, coach. Thank you. Thank you. Keith, uh, I didn't know uh, I'd ever hear Coach Schiller say he's speechless, but that's exactly what he said yeah. tonight. Yeah, he, he 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 is in tears. Keith, if you see one of the players, I know uh, you're wanting to get out of there. If you see somebody yeah. that uh, you want to grab and talk to right uh, quick. Uh, here, I'm on, I got Coach Boyd. All right, sounds good. Coach, guess you talk to old Jack Ivy, Joseph. Hey, Jack, what's, what's up, man? Man, what a win to come back to Red Bay for, wouldn't you? Yeah. Here you go. You oh, I got you. Okay. All right. Hey, Jack. Hey, Coach. Uh, coming back to Red Bay, uh, man, a great start. Uh, you got to be pumped there. To, uh, of course, you've always been a Tiger, but to get back here with the hometown folks, what a win for Red Bay tonight. I oh. think this may be the first time other than the forfeit that we've ever beat Hamilton. Yes, it is. I, I, I believe you're right. And um, First game back, home game, big win over Hamilton. Can't ask for anything better, man. Um, I'm going to tell you what, these guys give every ounce of energy. I don't know if they got any left for tonight, but uh, oh, they, they gave it all, didn't they? They probably don't. Um, uh, you know, we got a bunch of fighters, man. Um, we got a bunch of fighters in our locker room. Uh, really, really, really proud of these guys. Um, and, uh, you know, they fought hard all summer. Um, and, uh, you know, I know that they they fought through a lot of things, and they fought through last year, and, and um, you know, they – came out and they never give up and it was a street fight the whole game and and and, and, and they pulled it out and um, you know I could I couldn't be more proud of our football team and for for coach Shielders um, and the rest of the staff 